no beautiful star. I give you a hat. I give you a hat for this partner person. You're welcome. How you doing? Happy Tuesday. Uh, we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna have some fun. Uh, hope you're all having a good one. Um, I'm excited. What? Thank you. Banana machines. Not what I expect the tile screen to look like. If you've never seen this game before, it's uh, it's a good time. If you've only seen the memes of this Drop game. Door. Drop door. Was a man. Was a man. I mean, he was a dragon man. Dragon. Yeah, or maybe he was just a dragon, but he was still Trogdor. Thank you for the hammy. Turn off my anniversary well, well, inhibitors. Well, well, what this? this is the game of all time. I don't know how or why this became such a meme, because I played it back when it came out, goddamn over ten years ago now, um, and uh, and was like neat. It was very silly. A little fun little Metal Gear spinoff. And now it's just taking on a good life of its own. But I'm excited to share it all with you. Hopefully it works out. I'm playing the PC port, which uh, actually Nicole G Goodnight gifted to me. So shouts to Nicole. Uh, she's great. Uh, and apparently as a 10 plus year old PC port, it's good for its time, but maybe people are having issues with it with modern hardware. Um, yeah, shouts to Nicole. Uh, I do have the PS3 version here. So uh, worst case scenario, We'll have to stand by as I hook up. I did a brief test of the VR missions and it w worked perfectly fine. But people are reporting all kinds of weird issues on the Steam discussions. So um, I didn't check PC Gaming Wiki. That's probably a good idea. I was checking the Steam discussion page. Um, and people are like, I can't believe Konami hasn't patched this 10 year old port. It's like, well, eh. There are some fan made patch stuff, but I didn't fuck with any of those. I downloaded the game and I tested it and it worked. So I'm just giving you full disclosure that, like, Things might explode a bit. Um, no, I haven't done any upscaling, nothing. I'm not fucking with anything. Because um, a lot of people are like trying to run it at 4K with above 60 FPS frame rates and doing all kinds of hacks. And I'm like, the game is designed for 10, 1080p, 60 FPS. So that's that's my goal. Uh, so, still runs okay, but yeah, not always the best. Yeah, people are also, people have like really weird one-off issues where like, I reloaded the game and the UI is all broken. So it's like, eh, I don't know. But anyway, that's what I'm saying. If we need to, I can grab my PS3 and hook it up, and we'll just do it live. But uh, anyway, I'm very excited. Um, when do things not explode? It is a stream. Things are guaranteed to explode. That's the that's the nature of doing it live. If you're recording anything, things will break. And if you do it live, it increases the uh, breakability of everything by a thousandfold. Well, the PS3 finally decides to die. Don't jinx me like that. I haven't had a yellow light of death on that PS3. I got through MGS3, or sorry, MGS4. That was the like, I need my PS3 to survive until this point. Anything after that is gravy. Cause like this game is on PC, it's on Xbox, like it's around. MGS4 is for the time being locked onto the PS3. I'm hoping a Metal Gear Master Collection Volume 2 uh, includes MGS4 so to free it from the shackles of the PS3, but we'll see. Stream title, Fruit Ninja. That's a good title. Katamari, my beloved. Thank you for those subs and resubs and the hype train and all that. Thank you. Let's get caught up on stuff. Um, I, d I never downloaded PT on my PS4, though. So I never had it. R.I.P. Um, ba -ba 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 Doctor Anniversary. Yeah, it's my, it's my partnerversary, which I forgot is the thing that Twitch does. But uh, I guess I... Because my first one or two streams, I wasn't partner. And then I and then I DM'd a guy on Twitter that my a, a friend was like, hey, here's a contact at Twitch. And I DM'd him. He's like, you're partner now. And I was like, what? And he was at AGDQ. <laughs> I was like, huh? Okay. Uh, so that's me espousing my privilege unto the masses. But uh, that was when my partner anniversary was, was whenever that was. So yeah, hi, you up? Yeah. It was a different time uh, five, six years ago on Twitch. Platform has changed a bit at that time. Um, I was Panzer Dragoon. It's true. Me thumb partner in other contexts. Partner 
Oh, like 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 a like me and Bath partner? That's funny. No, it's Twitch partner, but that's that's a great idea though. Go learn about the DNA of the soul. Yeah. It's 2 a.m. I told you were the partner guy. That's just effectively how it went down. Hi, person I've never met. Partner? Question mark? And he's like, yeah, dude. I'm like, fuck it. Okay, anyway. Um, works for me, don't worry about it. Yeah, I mean, I, I, they, I, there's been some issues with the pat master collection, but they were patching it, to my knowledge. So. Remember this game is a parry. Yes. <laughs> That's, yeah, believe me. I, it's one thing I really struggled with when I first played the game, was I was like, I keep getting my ass handed to me, because this game has a very crucial mechanic, which we'll get to, um, that they don't really, from what I remember, they don't do a great job telling you about and is effectively required. And it's not a complicated mechanic, they just don't really tell you about it. Um, and I was talking to a friend about it around when the game came out, and they're like, yeah, let me show you. And I was like, this changes everything. So I do remember that, but thank you. Um, who is this guy, Perry? You Perry the Platypus? The mechanic is memes. Yeah, this, this game is a, uh, what? Hello? Twitch? Stream is disconnected. Why? <laughs> Hello? He Hello? Hello? Uh, uh... Stand by. 07. Uh... Stream is disconnected. Twitch? Twitch? Hello? Are we back? Nope. Stream is disconnected. Why? This is fitting music. But, 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 refresh. Welcome. Welcome back. Maybe welcome back. Not a rising stream. We back? Bump, bump, bump. It still says reconnecting. I'm still recording offline, so hi, VOD watchers. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. How about now? It says it says it's reconnected. We back. Yeah. <laughs> okay, now the question is... Uh... Hi, welcome back. Hi, how you doing? They took my memes. Now the question is, was that, um, th this will be frozen. That's because I all tabbed. Um, hi, hello. What was that mechanic? That was the parry mechanic in action. Don't tell me that Discord pinged everyone again. It's fine. Great. Um, remember that, th yeah. So is that a Twitch issue? Is that a me issue? Um, everything is operational on Twitch's end. Hmm, my connection got parried. It sure did. I got sniped. Well, if that happens again, maybe we switch to the PS3? Um, I don't know if that's the power of this port or what. Hey, welcome. Which be a toxic? Who knows? Hi. Hello. Thank you. Strandback. Thank you for the spooky skeleton bits. On your birthday. Happy birthday, Phoenix. He lives. He lives. Thank you. Uh, sorry about that pickup. Um, Vob and I'll be very funny. Well, I, I, I'm recording it locally. I, I, earlier in the year, I started recording every stream, just in case. Um, both for things like stream dying, but also because um, there's a feature in things like OBS where you can record different audio tracks to different audio tracks of a, of a local recording. So it makes it easier if I have to cut out audio from the VOD that gets copyright claimed. So there's also that, which I don't like to do, but it's easier because if it's just one recording on the VOD, then it's all the audio together. But if I can separate the uh, 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 the microphone. Anyway, um, do I have two PCs? Nope. Just the one PC that desperately needs an upgrade, which is why yeah, things break when I play PC games. Um, but yeah, I have, the PC, I have the PS3 ready to rock. Yeah, FF7, yeah, exactly, things like that. So, do you store the local VODs once the stream VOD is good and up on the VOD channel? Nope. <laughs> once once the VOD is good on YouTube, I'm like, I'm freeing up the space. Them VODs are, are chunky, a lot of gigabytes. The, the, the YouTube channel is my archive, and if the YouTube channel explodes, RIP, I'm not downloading terabytes of VODs <laughs> or storing them locally. Uh, I, I like having the VOD on, on uh, archive on YouTube, but I'm not. I'm, I don't need it. I don't need it personally. Download all of them now. What about archive.org? I don't. I don't. Personally, I don't. I don't. Yep. Yep. Are we about to cut every physical object? This is, we are going to Zandatsu. Also, yeah, the game is running in full screen. There's no native option for borderless windowed. It's a 10-year-old PC port. Anyway, let me try to get into it before the internet apparently hiccups again. Um, so, time to build an ass. Yeah, I mean, that's probably smart. 
I care more about archiving and backing up my files for like video production than I do for streams. Thanks for the thing and stuff. Um, I am lost media. Will we do the DLC? I didn't even know this game had DLC. Is it included in the PC port? Is it good? I don't think I played it back in the day. Um, did you finish watching us from last game? Uh, what, Peace Walker? I mean, this this has very loose connections to any Metal Gear game, let alone Peace Walker. It has the closest ties to four, but even then, this is like, kind of its own thing. Howdy, welcome back. It's available, it's where I played the entire game. Gotcha. Cool, cool, cool. Time to build an ass. It is. Indeed time to build an ass. Eight drive mass. Uh, Rose mentioned like once, that's it. Yeah, right? That's kind of it. Uh, anyway, um, Brian needs to put on some clothes. No! He's got the nail machines. This game is 10 years old. Yeah. Just got here. The stream sure didn't. Uh, no, it didn't. It's uh, good. Everything's fine. Is Revengeance before or after MGS4? Yes. I, I think it's after, but I don't know if it really matters. I mean, it matters in terms of Raiden's arc throughout MGS4. Where he's just like, I don't need to be a monster, I have a family. And then he puts the robot suit back on, which kind of, you know, but it's a cool robot suit. Uh, like, I, I, don't, uh, I don't know what to tell you, Ryden. You look rad, so, I don't know. It, it kind of fucks with it a bit, but, you know, it's cool. I mean, th this game had a pretty crazy development. We don't need to get into all of it, but if you want to look it up, it's neat. Where basically, Kojima Productions, the developers of the mainline MGS games, were making this game. And there was an initial trailer you can watch that clearly evokes a lot of what the final game ended up being. And then the game was soft cancelled. They, they stopped making it, but didn't publicly announce that it was cancelled. And Kojima, or someone from his team, was meeting with someone from Platinum. And he was like, oh my god, the Platinum guy is like, I'm so excited for Metal Gear Rising. And they're like, yeah, we couldn't quite get it to work. So we're not working on it anymore. And they're like, what? Oh, no. Can, can, what if we do? Uh, so that's when, uh, uh, thank you for that. Um, that's weird that the bar, you should have to unlock those, but I guess it just works. Anyway, I was distracted by that. So, uh, latest time, except for Acid 2. Well, I've never played the Acid games. Um, the fuck was that? Those are meant to be bit tier emotes, but I guess, I guess that just, it just works. Um. Well, what happens if you type, like, bar yups? Because that's another bit tier emote. Not anymore. Uh, shame that Kuna Kojima splitting from Konami means we'll never get a sequel to this game. Well, I mean, but again, so that that's part of the, the story. Is like, Platinum ended up making their own version of Metal Gear Rising Revengeance that's not the same version as what Kojima was making, just inherited a lot of the ideas and concepts, but became its own thing that Kojima, I think, like, executive produced. Um, so it's not the same game that that would have been but it's like if platinum and konami were like let's do another one then they could oh god Ch chat has so much power now <laughs> i i made this eight part emote for mithra because she uh, as the only person to have that many bit tier emotes unlocked from cheering bits so i was like fuck it you get an eight part emote that no one else has so on t on twitch it's just it just doesn't look like it's just the strings of text but up there it's actually somehow interpreting that to actually present properly. So, anyway, it works so well. Yeah, because it's a perfect fit. Oh God, he's getting, it's a sliding block puzzle now. This game is canon, could you wrote the script? I didn't know that. I mean, I did, I did figure that if and when I ever do a video about the Metal Gear Solid series, I would include this game just because it's just such a goddamn meme these days. Everyone loves this game. Anyway, enough preamble. Let me, uh, 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 I'm gonna alt tab over here. Um, oh, there were a couple things I wanted to mention quickly. Uh, first of all, during the last stream, a couple people came into chat and they're like, Oh, Iron Mouse is watching your Kingdom Hearts video. And I was like, that's right. I hope they enjoy it. And I, part of my brain was like, that name sounds familiar, but I don't really remember. Um, and also I was focused on the game. And then after the VOD, after the stream, I looked up her VOD and was like, Oh, right. She's one of the biggest streamers on the platform and won Gamer of the Year at the Game Awards. That's neat. So I watched her VOD reacting to... The, uh, she was watching viewer submitted videos um, and watched the Kmart's video and seemed to enjoy it. So I was like, that's neat. So I made a clip and did a little tweet where um, specifically the part where uh, I'm explaining the recusant sigil in Dream Drop Distance, where she had a really good just pause and just sigh, and it was very good. Um, so I, I, I tweeted that out and um, it was like neat. Um, and though Barry having been Zendatsu, Zendatsu. I nommed you. Thank you for case. I appreciate it. Gamer of the year. Reaction content. Yeah. I mean, yeah, that be it what it is. But uh yeah, I I, I did I did 
I'm not a crazy personal fan of the React meta, meta but contradictorily, contradictorily, I don't know the word, Jesus Christ, Katamari. Um, contradictorily, I, I really like watching people react to stuff I've made. As long as they're actually actively watching it and not just like, all right, chat, here's some entertainment while I go take a fiver. Um, when they're actually sitting there and watching it and reacting to it, I'm like, that's very fun. And seeing a chat going and reacting and who, a new audience that hasn't seen it, it's a lot of fun for me. So I enjoyed it a lot. You're listening to that, too bad. Streamer of the Year, Game of the Year in Feeling Show someone else. Oh, yeah, okay, maybe the exact name was different. Uh, but anyway, regardless, uh, that, was, that was fun. Um, and also, uh, yesterday, unrelated to any of that, um, uh, but uh, uh, Dan and Bath and Gam put together something they called the Zelda Bowl, where Dan and, and Bath were competing in a same seed Ocarina of Time randomized race. And, and they made a bunch of assets for it, and Gam was like an announcer host guy. Zooter Bowl, baby. Um, the Zooter Bowl. Did she not give credit? That was like the one thing where as I was watching it, there were people in the chat being like, who made this? Anyone have a link? So that was what I replied to myself on my Twitter thread. I was like, this is so cool. I have a lot of fun. Hey, by the way, you can watch whatever you want to watch of mine. You have full permission to react. Just like drop a link in the chat. Because, <laughs> However, she did give me a, a, a shout out on her stream yesterday. I don't know what the content. I was like, huh? I only saw that just now when I was booting up my stuff. Um, she watched a couple days ago. So I'm like, I don't know if the shout out was her... I'm not sifting through a 10-hour VOD to find the context. I don't know if she watched another video or what. But uh, anyway, I, 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 I'm not like, oh my god, I, I, I'm in a very privileged position. That video wildly exceeded my expectations. I don't really, I don't care about being paid in exposure. Uh, uh, but I'm not speaking on behalf of anyone other than myself, obviously. But it's like, if you're watching other people's stuff on stream, just throw a link in the chat. It's the easiest thing you could do. The bar is on the floor. Just let people be able to watch it themselves and share it. Um, but anyway, yeah, it was fun. That's why I know a lot of you are here because of that video, and I appreciate it. Anyway, I just really quickly wanted to share this clip from um, uh, Dan's stream because uh, that's where a bunch of Gam's shenanigans were on. So this was the Zooter Bowl. Bath and Jen representing Team Eggplants and Dan Jones representing Team Duckies. Uh, and Gam was updating this tracker at the bottom. Excuse me. They were doing um, a, uh, uh, a Triforce percent run. I don't remember the exact name for it. But basically, it's a setting you can, you can apply. Are those esports low? Yeah, they went full like NFL with it. Um, so uh, uh, you can set an Ocarina of Time randomizer to be like, you need to get all the, the, the MacGuffins in order to fight Ganon at the end. Or you can just add a bunch of Triforce pieces into the seeded pool of items. And once you get X number of Triforce pieces, then you win. So the tracker at the bottom was how many Triforce pieces they had. It was first the 20 pieces one. Um, so anyway... The Dan did the tracker numbers. Oh, the eighth and six, seven, five, three, oh, nine. Yeah. Anyway, uh, I don't know if the volume is good. No, I probably need boost it. Real quick. <laughs> oh. I want to. I want to. I want to. I want to take chat back a little bit. We we've got uh this segment here where where, where as you can see the eggplants are throwing some pots around, but as you can see they make the fatal flaw of throwing against the wall right up against the ledge, and you can see the item just barely out of reach, meaning they could go for that time loss and try and grab that, but instead <laughs> opt to just leave the room and reset, which is a major time loss because you really don't want that happening in a game like this where every second counts. Mm -hmm. This is so fucking good. <laughs> oh my god. Is this oh. Terraria? It's the fucking Terraria theme. Oh yeah, the randomized god. music. That was I, well done, Gam. Well done. <laughs> Gam was putting together live replays, which I just incredible. Anyway, so yeah, go 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 check out um uh Bath and uh Bath and Jan, cousin Dan Jones, Gamblord, all of the above. They're great. Um, yeah, ha, flashbang every time I tab back. You get, you don't get flashbang, but I do. So that's good. Have you seen his new mug? I did. He got the piss mug, the Pikmin piss mug. It was great. You're great. Does Dan have a VOD channel? He does. I don't know the name of it off the top of my head, but there's a link to it on his on his page. Um, also, I booted up this game. This theme sounds a thousand percent like one of the tracks from Tron Legacy, the Daft Punk soundtrack. It almost says the exact same like da 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 It's like barely different. The grid. 
duck door. Anyway, let me get cop on stuff. Uh, yeah. Every time I tab over, it's gonna freeze. That's just nor. It's good. It's fine. Don't make me all tab during the stream. The digital frontier. Uh, in between streams, there was a, a resub, or sub, perhaps, by XX, your username, XX. So thank you. I should all tap. Don't. And also, this video game, Melgy Rising Revengeance, was recommended I streamed by It's Nerf or Nathan back in, like, 2018. I can't listen because DMCA, but you can't chat. The Tron Legacy OSD is incredible. Um, it's Nerf or Nathan, Amphi139, Marst, Kunkus, aka Robin, Anonymous, Crunchy, Smash Mat 202, Para Paradoxican, Lady Hellgates, and Queen of Size. So we're doing it. Best Daft Punk album. I don't know if I agree it's the best Daft Punk album because all of their albums are great, but uh, it's one of my favorite film soundtracks, I think. Not even a thing. It is. Oh, what have you? What have you done? What have you done to my boy? What have you done to him? Uh, ba -ba -da -ba -ba -ba. Smash Bros. for the hammy. The very fitting MGS3 RNG. Hammy. Happy partnersary. Perfect game to celebrate. Remember when this came out? A lot of people seemed to hate on it because of how drastically different it was from traditional MGS. For whatever reason, this game got resurged in popularity a couple years back. Suddenly, it's a beloved classic and a prime meme fodder. Looking forward to reliving it. Same. I don't remember it having a very controversial reception. Again, there are a lot of people like me who are like, why? I'm really bad at this, because you need a parry. Um, at least within my immediate friend circle, people were, were into this game. But uh, I don't really remember the public discourse at the time. It just was a weird Metal Gear spin-off made by Platinum, and then it just sort of faded into obscurity, and then just weirdly came back a couple years ago. Yeah, I thought people liked it, but it was more controversial. It was so different. I mean, I'm not discounting that that probably happened, but I get from... from what I interacted with in person online, online, it was just like, I don't know, it seems, it's very goofy and weird. The first time, you'll see once we get in, assuming that it doesn't explode my computer, um, when you're fighting, the, I, I vividly remember the first Metal Gear Ray fight, it's very early in the game, and then it was, I was jamming out to the soundtrack, and then lyrics burst into the, into the song during a pivotal moment in the fight, and I was like, what the fuck is this butt rock? I was like immediately enthralled by it. Uh, yeah, I, th I don't remember. If it might be rules of nature, but regardless, I was just like, man, what have you? What are you? What are you doing to him, chat? He's all scrunched up. The music kicks ass. It's very good. Uh, Rise of Luke's. Thank you. They Sonic Adventure. They went full Sonic Adventure. Uh, Winter Rose, thanks for 73 months. Happy anniversary. Thank you. Thanks for supporting me all these years. Whether this is your first stream or you've been here since like a billion years ago, thank you for letting me be a goobus on the internet. I love it. Reord again, thanks for two years. Can't wait for this beautiful mess. Milky Bork, thanks for 37 months. Did you know? It's my partner anniversary. It is. Carrollton, thanks for six months. 23 Skidoo, thanks for 44. Been waiting for this one. Center Serbot, thanks for the 100 bits. Fun fact, my name has nothing to do with this game. I just like the cadence and how they both start with suh. I never thought that it was tied to this game, but if you're like, by the way, it is a reference, I'd be like, that makes sense. Excuse me. Rocker Jason Charles Miller went on to sing many games for FF14. Really? Howdy, this. So, I don't know if this is the first game to tie a soundtrack during the game, but it's the first I ever saw, and it's amazing. It's definitely not the first, but they do a good job of it. Agents of Chaos, thanks for 10 months. Rival Link, thanks for 17. When the Metal Gear Rises. Cute Mel, thanks for four years. Blangry gifted a sub to C Zhao. Barry Dingle, thanks for 17. Me, one nano machines. Kale the Dragon, thanks for 59 months. Thanks, Barry Dingle, for the soup. Smart Farkles, 34 months. Dave, thanks for 100 bits. Gonna go catch up on more VODs. I'm excited to watch this one in two, three months. Happy part anniversary. Thank you. Hope you enjoy the VODs. Arthur Incognito, thanks for 11 months. Finally here for the start of a Metal Gear. Now, hopefully my power doesn't go out and I can stay here. Hopefully the stream doesn't die again. I don't know what is happening that the last stream too, or was it two streams ago? Just, yeah, it was during uh, American Arcadia. Just random blips with stream. Hopefully it levels out. I mean, the good news is that the VOD is not broken up. Th because, I don't know. Like, sometimes my local recording does die. But... Thought. I am not thank you, Ascended. And thank you, Ugron. Thank you. The bot just re is really excited. God, you love American Arcade. I really enjoyed it. More than I expected to. I really had a good time. It would suck if Twitch lay off a bunch of their stuff. Mm. Uh, but, 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 uh, Smash Bros. for Spooky Skeleton 666 Bits Rules of Nature. I'm just gonna have to blast the game's volume and just not talk over large swaths of this game. 
probably. Are you racing? You're re replacing my brain with rat jam. That seems very appropriate. Uh, Jacob Bacon, thanks for the hammy. Happy partner anniversary this year. Now you've been streaming as long as you worked at Grumps, which is crazy to think about. I know. Can't believe I've been watching you for 10 years in some capacity since this 2014 is the year. I'll start watching Grumps. Here's to hopefully many more years. I, I had the same thought recently that like you could split my online career in half now at this point, which is nuts to think about. Yeah, I saw the news about Unity. I feel for all them devs. And uh, it reinforces my decision to not... But I, I think I mentioned it before, but I legitimately don't expect a Barry's House 3 because Barry's House 1 and 2 were made in Unity, and I have no interest in using Unity anymore. And I do not have enough experience with another engine at this point to do something like that. So April Fool's this year will probably be a dumb, silly stream. It probably won't have excessive production values put into it as I continue to figure out. I want to learn Godot. I just haven't made the time yet. Mm -hmm. And the tools I was using to connect into Unity's backend, um, I don't know how to port that to make it work with Godot. I don't know enough about it. So, we will see. RIP the house. We had two good years. I'm happy. But yeah. I'm gonna start learning myself. Hope it goes well. Chat makes a video too. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see. I don't know exactly what it'll be. But in Unreal. Mm, yeah, Nanite. Nanite Barvatar. Toaster Posey, thanks for 83 bits. This seems like it will be normal. It will be. Onsta, thanks for four and a half years. Happy Disco Prince. Da, ba, ba, da, ba, ba. Barry Dingle, thanks for 10 bits. Meister Jazz, 69. Ready for whenever chaos and silliness this game will be. Same. JC Maxwell, thanks for 500 bits. Diffminky42, thanks for seven months. Nano Machine, son. Cyberspace Cat, thanks for 57. Doctor, turn off my poob inhibitors. They're already off. Crap. Boogaboo, thanks for seven months. Hope you enjoy memes. I love memes. Dave, thanks for 52 months, Dave Kazer. Crazy person, 23, thanks for 71 months. The DNA of the soul, the memes. Nerd Queen, thanks for six months. Enjoy your golden key. Happy subversary, thank you. Femme of Center, thanks for seven months. I saw us go from six months to seven months in a matter of seconds. What is the truth? Time is what we make of it. Thank you. He's trying to stretch him. It doesn't. That only works with BTTV emotes. Um, uh, Smash Bros, thanks for 100 bits. Hopefully everyone loves the music. I shared rules of nature with my younger sister. She wasn't into what she called techno screamo. See me more into it has to be this way. Uh, not, this, this game's soundtrack is not for everyone, but I think in the game's context, every single person on planet Earth is into it. I'm gonna make that declaration that, like, you might not be into this type of music, but in the context of this game, it's the best thing you've ever heard. That's what makes it work. In, in the same way of, like, Sonic Adventure or games like that, where you're just like, oh my god, I'm being blasted with the best thing I've ever heard in my life. And maybe you like listening to it outside the game, maybe not, but... It's just like, it gets you good. Never seen this game in motion. Be sure to let us know. Uh, well, it's Joan. Thanks for 13 months. Partnerversary, ready for laws of ecology. Levi Phipps, thanks for 23. Barry Dingle, thanks for a spooky skeleton bits. Uh, Water the dog, thanks for five months. Universal Virus, thanks for 50 bits. Who tripped over the wire? Who did? Uh, well, it's Joan, thanks for a soup. Ryden, turn off the Twitch stream. <laughs> Ryden, you're just a chatter in a Twitch. Ryden, you're trying to comment on a VOD. In the live chat. Right, and the streamer won't see it. Right. Jay Dizzle, thanks for 59 months. Wiley Doctor, thanks for two years. Two years subversing my favorite Metal Gear slash Platinum game. Perfect timing. This might be my favorite Platinum game, too. To be fair, there's a lot of Platinum games I have not played that I've been meaning to check out, but... Yeah, this one's, this one's solid. Right. I need scissors. 69. Nice. Uh, but, but, but. Jay Dizzle, thanks for 59 months. Three bees in a trench coat, thanks for four years. Five Leisure, thanks for five bucks. I'm excited for these streams. This game's so fun. I'm excited too. LJ Ride Home, thanks for 41. Time for the Sonic the Hedgehog of Metal Gear Games. This is more the Shadow the Hedgehog of Metal Gear Games. I think it's more, more the Shadow than the Sonic. Uh, Invisible Hammer, thanks for four months. This is the first stream I've caught since New Year's. Happy Odd Lang Sign. Same to you. Happy New Year. Ugron, thanks for the hammy. Rules of Nature. I'm playing a game my other monitor. Maybe too occupied to rock out later. So, Luke, please, Luke, peace. Rules of Nature. Thank you. Nectarine, thanks for seven months. Do you think a Nano Machines boy and a, and a Micro Machines girl can be together? I haven't thought about Micro Machines in many years. Thank you for that. Uh, Clover Friend, thanks for 40 months. Pog Champ, so glad you're starring Revengeance. Currently in the Peace Walker VODs, won't be sticking around. Thanks for the content, streamer man. Thank you. Chat, you cool as heck. Chat is very cool. Thank you. All right. Let me uh, kid up Chris Uprising 1. Fun fact. In order to find the people that recommended this game in the rec form, I, I did a control F for Rising, and most of the Rising results were for Uprising. <laughs> I was like, yeah, maybe we'll check that out. Uh, and thank you for the bit, Smash Bit. 
It has to be this way. It wins with 20 votes. What the fuck are these song names? Got 18. Stains of Time got 9. Rules of Nature 8. Only thing I know for real. Got a mere 6. Couldn't fit in Red Sun or Strange Dry Main. They're all good. Thank you. Um, Alright, let's let's try to start this game. Let's try to get this train rolling out of the station. See if it explodes my computer. Um, bum 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 bum. Bum 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 bum. Boop boop boop. Just gonna try to... Yeah! Close some things out. Alright. How we doing? Bop, 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 bop. I'm more worried about the internet dying again, frankly, than anything else. Uh, file three? File one. Be a rebel? No. File one. Put me in. Uh, this game features autosave. Don't exit. I would never stop. Can't stop, won't stop. Boop, 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 boop. All right. Metal Gear Rising Revengeance. Uh, let it be known that this might be one of the best titles of any video game ever. Revengeance! The name of the game is, like, we've been living with this name for 11 years. So, like, I understand it's been doled with time, but, like, they named the game Revengeance. <laughs> like, come on. That's really good. Anyway, let's, let's fucking go. What lore do we need to know for the game? Raiden is a ninja and he likes to kill dudes. Let's go. Normal difficulty, please. Play tutorial. Yeah. I probably need a refresher. It's been a bit... I love me some Portman toes. Let me know how the volume is and stuff. Body status. Ben, let's begin with a quick warm-up, shall we? Thank you, Dr. Check Horn. the Soliton radar on the upper right and head to the point marked on the display. You can jump over obstacles, but the ninja run will get you across them more quickly and easily. Dolores is a ninja and he hates to kill dudes. Well, most of the dudes in this game are robots. Ninja run! Parkour, 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 parkour. Parkour, parkour. Parkour, parkour. Action point. Zoom. You can also attack while in motion it's, with the ninja run, you know. Swinging your blade door. while dashing, for example. Or striking your foes with a sliding attack. Ninja run. Dash attack. Slide. It's actually an injury. <laughs> Everything about this game is absurd, okay? You ain't seen nothing yet. Blade Oscillator engaged. Now then, let's run a basic battle diagnostic. Try and neutralize all the enemies that appear. Yeah, if you've been surprised so far, this is literally... String the light and strong hits together to perform combination attacks. Left trigger hold for blade mode. Oh yeah, we'll get to that. <laughs> It might be a smidge loud, yeah. Combat is not all offense, however. You also need to protect yourself. First, follow the direction of the enemy's attack. Parry those attacks by executing light attacks of your own in the same direction. This is how you parry. It is the keystone of your defense. This is incredibly important. Push in the direction wow. of the enemy's attack. <laughs> They're robots! They're ro they're robots. The blood is hydraulic as fluid. As possible and parry their blows to leave them exposed to counterattack. From your perspective, it will appear as if the enemy is frozen in time, or at least moving very slowly. This is the perfect opportunity for you to carefully aim your right. strike. <laughs> right, has never killed a man. Apart. Keep in mind, even you will not be able to parry every type of attack. Watch your foe's movements carefully. I was not pressing at the perfect moment. So what, how do I know the perfect moment? Oop. Fight me. 
Fight me. Not then. This game's teaching my priority said it doesn't. So if you skip the tutorial, the game never teaches you. And also, if even though they teach you, it's not made clear. Like, you literally can't proceed in the game without parrying. It's not like an extra, like, oh, you can do that if you want. It's like, you need to parry. Like, pretty early in the game, there's a wall where if you don't parry, you're just stuck. Three years. We've come so far in just three short years. The sign of a strong leader, sir. No. The will of a strong people. And one very able advisor. Thank you, sir. Your team deserves credit as well, Mr. Lightning Bolt. Just doing our job, Mr. Prime Minister. There he is. I must admit, I once thought of groups like yours as opportunists, enablers of war. No. But you've trained our new army well. Order has returned sooner than expected. Perhaps I was wrong about these private military companies. We prefer private security providers, sir. Most of Maverick's contracts do focus on security. Yes, well, the security can mean many things. There's a saying I like. One sword keeps another in the sheath. Sometimes the threat of violence alone is a deterrent. That's the Sometimes moral of Metal Gear, all right. Life, others can be preserved. That's what all the games have been about, right? And you got it. You understood the it's premise. It's the code the samurai lived by. Hmm. A soldier and a philosopher. You are full of surprises, Mr. Lightning Bolt. I could say the same about you, Mr. Prime Minister. War has not changed. <laughs> <laughs> what is happening? Someone's blocking a lead vehicle. Hold on. Gact Sands tax evasion? Clear the road! This is official state business! Sex stream Sam. This game is extremely bloody. It's just red oil. Mm -hmm. He was in need of an oil change. <laughs> Who was that? <laughs> that damn smile. Courtney, what is happening? We got hit, sir. A cyborg. Cool. Up unaffiliated. Wait, he, he uploaded a JPEG? You check yes, the exit data? Take off his jacket like that. His briefcase is way lighter than it looks. 
locked in the car. Where did that come from? It doesn't matter. Turn off your brain, chat. Turn it off. Take out those hostiles. You'll need to choose between light and heavy strikes to match the situation. Take self-repair units from your foes to replenish your own supply. Right it. The limo is in trouble. Get back there. ASCP. Oh. I'll add the limo to your solid down radar. Thanks. Zendat. This game is amazing. My car. This blew my gut. It still kind of blows my mind. Like, it's so rad. <laughs> What is this, Wii Sports Resort? Yeah. Ba -da 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 -da. Right, he's on the other side of that barricade. That's one of the main mechanics of the game. Sandat. Did you guys drop any goodies? It's extremely unnecessary. It's so necessary. Game's a little loud. I could smooch it down. That's that. I'll just crank it up for cutscenes. How's that? Is that a better bounce? Thanks for letting me know. Bow, 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 bow. What? That was thinking about Skip 4 and more cutscenes in the game. Yeah, that's fair. You're, this game is essentially its own. Ooh, ooh, ooh. That's goofed up. Oh, okay. Uh, yo. They die like Mega Man. Yeah. If you can't come right. through the barricade, try the fence, huh? <laughs> so I eat gummy bears? It's good. A lot of dead robots. There are a lot of dead robots. Yeah, so. So when you enter this mode, it says on the left. You can... What are you doing, right? Get to that limo. Yeah. You can mash X for horizontal, Y for vertical. Or if you use the right stick, you get full control. And if you, like, I'm holding it left and I swing it right, he does that. I, now I'm holding it right and I swing it left. So you get, like, really fine control over how you slice stuff up. And it's just kind of rad. It's like... It's so good. Get to the limo. I don't know if you can cut these. You sure can. Jesus Christ. So someone said it's so unnecessary, and like, yeah, it is. Um, I would argue it's incredibly necessary to the game feel of this game, because while you're fighting shit, just like random stuff in the disc, like trees and light poles and stuff, just get destroyed as you're fighting stuff. And it's not like, oh, you broke it apart and it has a scripted explosion, like, crumble apart. It's like extremely dynamic based off of how you cut things. like. It's fucking dope. It's really neat. No game I, that I can think of has really done this. How do I get back door? How do I jump? It's definitely necessary. Just, just break, just break it. Okay. It did bleach. It did ignite.
He's fine. He's a robot. Robots can't feel fear or pain. <laughs> See? Robot. He's not a robot, though, so, you know. He's in danger. Or is he a robot? Stop! Cyborgs aren't robots. I think some of them are actually robots. Yeah. Hello. <laughs> So you're Jack. What do you want with the Prime Minister? I want him dead. Nothing personal, of course. Africa's just getting a bit too peaceful. What? Business ain't been the same since they shut down SOP. After MGS4. A clean break from the war economy. Huh. Well, some of us lack that economy. How's an honest warmonger supposed to make a living? This is your answer. <laughs> Don't do it! This game's kind Don't of amazing. Now. I won't. I think I'm seeing now why... Not while he's still useful. Why this game has come back in such a strong way. <laughs> so long. It's so over the top. Yeah, the facial animation is excellent. They have a metal gear? Here? Right. Take out that UMG and get that. Catch yeah. that missile before it falls. Yeah, it's fine. Get back here. Use your danger run for the flight of shots. I love those MGS2 noises. Oh, I, I let go. Stop it. Makes sense. Locked around to the other foot.
it down. Did you say break it down? Doctor. Stop it, Blade. I'm telling you, the first that that moment has stuck with me all the like a, literally for a decade. Cause I, you start this game, you're like, okay, I run around and I slash stuff. That's it's you know it's neat. And then that moment happens, it's like, wait, was that lyrics? It was lyrics for like half a second. What? And they have this like gorgeous shot of him cutting it in half. And you're like, all right, all right, back to running around, I guess. You could parry his feet, oh, but right when they slam down. That's good to know. Anyway. Denry gives a win. Mm hmm. Let's go. Hello. Nice couch. I think it should be uh, two chairs. Yeah. You're welcome. Interior decorator riding saves another apartment. Nice joke there. Thank you. I don't know if there's anything hidden. Nice painting. Oh my God, it's indestructible. Thank you. Interior design is his passion. Remember my trouble yet? Get, Get back here. Ninja run. Use your ninja van to move over obstacles automatically. <gasps> Get back. Why do you wait for me, sir? Do not let him out of your sight. You must catch him. Oh. Oh. Come on. Get up. Get up. Damn it. Another one. That damn you, Jesus. It still works? Sorry, same one. Don't like that. Whoop. Whoop. Ow.
Thanks for the bit. Oh, he's fine. This is the first level. Do it again. They really had an animator on the team whose job was shit eating grin. Did he just drift with heels? You bet he did. He's headed for the front of the train. After him. Brandon, an unidentified tilt roader is headed your way. Keep an eye out for it. A tilt roader? I hardly even know him. Ba -ba -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba Hello. Prime oh. Minister! Too little too late, hero. I won't be needing my little shield here any longer. Stop! What about all the good things war has done for us? Why don't we ever hear speeches about that? Jobs, technology, a common purpose? Uh, Hold on, he has a point. Raiden, forget me. Stop him. <laughs> you ain't listening. <laughs> Mind if I got in? Saying, give war a chance. No, cinema. <laughs> Not the Gmod impact. <laughs> He's a cyborg, right? Uh, he was. This game is rated F for holy shit. What did they just do? <laughs> yep. Out of my way! He's all yours, Sam! Let's go. Yes! Fuck yeah! Let's fucking go! Not half bad. Still. <laughs> Your 
technique lacks something. <laughs> What is it? His blade is glowing. What does that mean? Oh god. How do I heal? Oh god. You don't get dunked on. Now I'm good. I'm at 0.1%. <laughs> You deny your weapon its purpose. That damn smile. It yearns to bathe in the blood of your enemies, but you hold it back. No. My sword is a tool of justice. You made him cooler! Sam, you fool! Gunblade, Brent, yeah. Are you all right? You're almost yeah, out of the tunnel. Just hang on. Yeah, I'm good. Hold on. I'm good. I like that Sam also has a scar over his his, uh, his left eye. He just wanted his BF to match. Yeah, I got this. This is what happens Didn't when you bring a white. tour to a sword fight. Yep. It's over. Yeah, he ate a lot of, a lot of ketchup. <laughs> Lucky devil. <laughs> I get it. No, that's not Solid Snake. Yippee. <laughs> the shot of him in the background. I got it, hey. First time playing this? No, I played it back when it came out. 10, 11 years ago. Uh. You'd think the conductor would stop the train. I know, right? All right, yep, I did, yep. Mm -hmm. No Zendatsu, I guess not. Oh. Sure. Hey, thanks for the bits. Sleepy Jetstream, call that Pajama Sam. Yeah, Pajama Sam is uh, the prequel series. About Jetstream Sam. 
Three weeks li Three weeks later. So good. I've got a clean visual. A direct feed to your optic nerve. <laughs> yes, I should hope so, huh? I mean, how does it feel? To fly like a bird. Like a bird strapped to a remote control rocket. Thanks for telling <laughs> you. <laughs> we will get you in safely, Tovarich. Just relax and enjoy the ride. Right. The Robo Jaw. Can you hear me, Raikul? Doctor. Remember the two procedures to maintain your new body. One, seizing nano repair units from your foes. And two, absorbing their electrolytes. I got it. Yes, got a sidewalk should provide plenty of MCFC electrolytes once you slice them open and uh, extract their fluids. They're terrorists. I was planning on that anyway. You be gotta drink them. Oh, and their left hands, if you please. Excuse me. Is a combat data stored on holographic memory, typically located in the left hand. That data is very valuable. <clears throat> I am authorized to offer you upgrades and services in exchange for it. How generous. Ich liebe Kapitalismus. Had the world come down a few years earlier, I would have a Nobel Prize on my shelf. There, I see land. Enough about that. Three mics out closing. Shut up, Doctor. No activity at the airbase. Looks like we don't need to worry about interceptors. Great. Then we have time for a quick briefing. I know you miss me, Kev, but I've been all over the materials. <laughs> That's what you said before Montenegro. Look, just humor me, buddy. Objectives, of course, are enter Abkhazia, neutralize the terrorists, and restore the rightful government. Or what's left of it, anyway. The president and most of the cabinet have been killed, and a military junta's been established. The terrorists brain-jacked all the high-ranking officers, and their cyborgs scattered the rank and file. The few leaders who have survived have no way of openly opposing the new regime. That's why they called us. Andrei Dolsev, leader of the occupation forces, an extremist linked to both the St. Petersburg massacre of 2015 and last year's terror spree in Georgia. And his arms supplier, none other than Desperado Enforcement LLC. Imani's killers. If we don't stop them here, they could destabilize the entire region. But our more immediate problem is Jetstream Sand. I believe you've met. <sighs> the only problem I see is that nickname. I've got my enhancements this time. He won't be an issue. He may not even be in country. But keep an eye out, Justin. No. Oh. Uh, sorry. Ready for insertion. Too soon, buddy. How how did he air break that with his bot uh, doesn't matter. Doesn't ma yeah. He's moving very fast right now. He's gay. You're right. He keeps the heels and the nails. Nice. Video games. Ryder, you landed safely, duh? First, head duh. inland. The waypoint is marked on your solid gun radar. Contact us on Kodak if you have questions. Yeah, all right. His thighs could almost turn me straight. <laughs> Damn, dude. Let me see you shake that thighs, thighs, thighs. Oh. The bastards are using Go back for the cat. There's a cat? Nice try. But it won't do any good against a state-of-the-art cyborg like you, eh? To bury incoming hits, throw out your own barrage of light attacks while your foe is on the offensive. Bury at just the right moment to deflect an attack and expose your enemy to counterattack. Eh. 
Give me that. Yes! Yes! Marry at just the right moment to deflect an attack and expose your enemy to counterattack. Give me that. Get off! Yummy! Oh, you said there's a cat? No! Did I fuck up? Can I not go back for the cat? Don't forget the arm. You're right, I need to chop off their arms. Gamer fuel is stored in the spine. Had your fill? Mm -mm. With this body, I could take these guys with no eyes. Intel wasn't exaggerating on the cyborg count. Well, you know how fast the tech's been spreading these last few years. That CNT muscle fiber packs the power of a jackhammer into every limb. What enterprising soldier of fortune could resist? And cyborgs are still human. Real thinking people. No, they're not. Less risk of collateral mm -hmm. damage than your typical UAV They're robots, strike. and I don't feel bad. And don't forget the PR angle. Nations start playing Frankenstein with their troops, and the public goes nuts. PMCs, on the other hand, are off the ethical radar. Mm -hmm. Yeah. They still don't even count PMCs in official death tolls. With SOP out of the picture, private militaries needed a new edge on the market. We got it. In a way, cyborgs are just SOP troops by another name. Only all muscled up and less predictable. But it makes you wonder, where'd Desperado find these guys? I'm not complaining. They're like walking vending machines. Right. Vending machines full of blood. <sighs> Easy there, Dracula. Like I said, they're still people. People who terrorize and take innocent lives for money. They sowed their fate when they took this job. I'm just the Reaper. Damn. It's a bit cold, Raiden. Even for you. Anyway, uh, his school. Let's get to work. Time to increase the peace. Right. Oh, the dialogue is so bad, it's good. It loops all the way around. No damage, baby. Zandatsu. Zandatsu. Zandatsu tutorial is not playable. Thanks. Where's the cat? Y'all told me there's a cat. Whoa. Beach cat. Beach cat. Doctor, are you getting this? Doctor. Oh my god. Doctor, are you analyzing my feed? Doctor, get over here quick. Oh my god, Doctor. Don't drink that, little guy. It's salty. Raiden, you'll need to head inland. Not now, Boris. But first, make your way through this building. Boris, I'm busy. Hey, little guy. I don't think I can crouch or anything. No. Doctor, turn off my cat inhibitors. Doctor. Doctor, please. Slash at cat, please. I would never. Try to cut the cat. What? He's got the moves. He's got them whatever like reflexes. Holy shit. Dude's got moves. Look at him go. <laughs> Look at him. Try blade mode. I... He's got the moves. I'm just trying to pet you, little guy. He can cancel out of attacks in the blade mode. Neat. All right. Goodbye, cat. See you later. Nice. Put that in my lock, Doctor. I hit a barrel. Yeah, I definitely forgot about all the meta progression stuff in this game. Right, this is Boris. Give me your status. Looks clear. Oh, yeah. No one in sight. I am. Good. Let's recap the route you will take. It's from this era of game design. The enemy's HQ is in the refinery along the coastline. Dolsayev has been spotted there using satellite photography. Also on site, Mistral, a desperado captain. Mistral. So I go through the city, cross the bridge into the old town. Then head down to the rear of the refinery. Still, I think they anticipate us. 
They will probably have a grand reception awaiting you at the old city. Do not let your guard down. Fault in the cat. Yeah. Time to crate. Done. Game design was still in beta. Yeah, it was it, it was from that era where it's like cool games make you walk slow and listen to Intel on the radio. Someone said if you if you break those the stairs at the beginning of the beach, if you cut those, you get soft locked, which is kind of amazing. Especially if they never patch that. Head to the indicator. I know! I'm running around. Hostels in the lower corridor, I see. Try to flank them, or approach from behind. You can't jump down, there's a rock. Okay. That's good. You can ninja run up if you cut the stairs. Action. Where's your left hand? Give me. Did I get it? Did I cut off his left hand? Excellent, Raiden. I don't think I got his left hand. Because the Zandatsu spine bit is like highlighted, but the arms aren't. Think I got him? How do I Raiden, know? Take that main thoroughfare. You can use augment mode to see where the enemy is located. Your body analyzes radar and IR data to construct your AR display. Huh. Some civilians are still in the city. That is not good. Uh -huh. The left hands you need glow green. It's not everyone's left hand. Only some of them. Toggle AR display. Oh. Item. I thought the, that box was sus in the other room. Well, rip. A grenade. So it's... So there's like a pulse. Let me see. I am the essence of stealth. Hey. How you doing? I'm being stealthy, like in a Metal Gear game. Never mind. Whoop. Yoink. RIP hostage. There's hostages? Is it like Peace Walker? The answer is the shop to buy moves at this point, including the dodge, but you don't have for some reason. No! No! Let go! Wait, 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 wait! Ah! If it touches the ground, then it's... It's icky. Correction, there were hostages. Like, Mission 12? I love Mission 12. How do I... How do I access the shop? Uh, Doctor, customer. Titus, shall we review the capabilities of your new body? Copy that. Go ahead, Doc. As we discussed, you've been outfitted with two revolutionary new abilities. Between levels. Fuel electrolyte absorption and self-repair from C's nano paste. Mm, Precise. Thermal paste. First, electrolyte absorption. This is simplicity itself. As your HF blade is linked directly to your fuel cells, simply cut into any source of electrolytes. Say, a hostile cyborg made up of CNT muscle fiber. And your fuel cells will recharge on their own. Rather elegant, wouldn't you say? I would indeed. It's been great so far. But, ah, the repair process is a bit more uh, involved. A bit more messy, you might say. Most military cyborg models store a cache of biotic self-repair nanopaste in their lower abdomen. So I need to slice them open and use Zandatsu to extract it. Cut and take, in other words. Correct. Zandatsu. Once extracted, you need only to crush this unit in your hand to absorb the repairing agent inside. Keep in mind, it is extremely delicate. If the unit should hit the ground, some paste will surely leak out. It will still repair your body, but less so than if you can retrieve it directly Don't touch the ground. before your foe falls over. Five seconds. Basically, harvest their organs before their body can even hit the ground. Rather gruesome, I realize. But then you Americans enjoy a bit of gore, don't you? I may be a citizen, but I've never really thought of myself as American. Oh? Hmm. Well, yes, I suppose I could understand that, given your history. But what then? Surely you don't identify as a Liberian. I don't identify soup. with anyone. No nation. I identify no with group. soup, Doctor. I'm my own man. 
Anyway, I seem to recall those gory torture porn movies were pretty popular in Germany, too. Indeed, indeed. Doctor? These splatter films are big in Germany, Russia, Japan, everywhere. Well, everywhere except regions afflicted by actual warfare. It all has to do with taming our fears, you know? Huh? The desire to feel fear, to taste death, but from a safe distance. These films allow the viewer to delude themselves into thinking they have overcome their fears. This... Okay, uh, okay, Doc. I, I got the gist. Let's save the full psych lecture for some other time, though, huh? I'm not kink-shaming, Doc. You don't have to justify it. Say? She's the safe. That's good. Did, did they... Life signs are nil. Guess I was too late. <sighs> Copy that. Back to the mission, I guess. There were hostages? I know they said there were people still in the city. I guess I didn't know there were consequences to just run around. <sighs> that sucks. I know it's not part of our mission, but I don't like seeing innocent civilians die for no reason. Yeah. Think there's any more of them here, Kev? Doubt it. It was all out war over at the palace. Once the evacuation order was issued, everyone should have fled to neighboring me? towns. Some of the Oops. cabinet were caught leaving Sukumi, though, and a lot of citizens got caught up in the crossfire. Some folks probably stayed put. Figured it's too dangerous to do anything else right now. Bad situation. Let's not let it get worse. Keep an eye out for more of them. If they're in a pinch, try and help out. Just make sure you don't hurt them. Got it. I'll be fine, probably. So you could not stop them. Well, so be it. Perhaps you've got enough to worry about. Eh, right. It happens. Thanks, Boris. My next question is to start storing off from the last checkpoint. Maybe a checkpoint before the hostages died. Maybe it's fine. Maybe it's okay, actually. Maybe this is for the best. You win some, you lose some. Customized body. Whoa. What the fuck? Okay, original body. Is fight against Tammy Desperado. Yep. It's pretty good. Original body. Yep. Make sure the cyber body used in Guns of the Patriots. That's a lot of points. Great Fox. Yeah, look at him. White armor. Inferno armor. Commando armor. Okay. Main weapon. It's really fox blade. So it has a special effect or it does enhancements. Strength plus one, absorption plus one, energy enhancement plus one. Okay, I can afford those. That's good. Um, there you go. Life. Endurance of the version of his, uh, uh, of his firmware that reshapes the musculature whenever he's hit. Reduce the amount of damage taken. Well, that seems a good investment. Update my firmware for my muscles. Steel cells. Uh, it represents an AR as extended fuel cell gauge. Okay. Skill! When you need skill. Aerial parry. An updated version of a cyber weapon is available. Invokes pounds when born. A parry enemy attacks in midair. Seems nice. Defensive offense. Allows faster, more detailed feedback to deliver to his brain synapses. Uh, allows our to freely sidestep enemy attacks in any direction. So that's the dodge, <laughs> was what it sounds like. Sky high improves the reaction speed and squad steps, enabling special upward thrust. You're playing on MGR? Play for three hours, couldn't get into it. I mean, I remember having quite a lot of fun. I remember there being a couple difficulty spikes later on. So we'll see how that goes. But, um, dodge moving really, really good. Gotcha. That is the dodge. Noted. Uh, that's a thrust. Sweep kick. And able to nimbly lower his body and execute a special foot sweep maneuver. Thunder strike. Channel air pressure into a shockwave. Give me this. Yes. How do I use it? Maybe once I load back into the game. Aerial parry sounds nice, but I think just having more damage, being able to take more damage, can't hurt. And I don't know if I can afford any enhancements. Um, no. All right. Best offense is a good defensive offensive, etc. All right. Let's rock. Okay. Light and heavy at the same time. Now yeah, we're back to. Oh, there's the hostage. He's, he's right, he's right there, there, right there, next to the barrel. So how do I... Oh, that does use up. Pause, help. There is no help. Uh, 
Three line attack, slight pause, then X for a launcher. Turn attack, right back kick, triple kick, flurry kick, tornado slash, like the hev heavy than light. Stab kick, cross slice, low roundhouse, triple kick, up swing, throat slicer. Y, 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 X, Y. Now, so sir, Y, slight pause, then X. Y, slight pause, then X, Y. This is a lot of things. This is a lot. X and A. Okay, yep. So it's light attack and jump. That's interesting. Okay, I see. So it is the defensive offense in that you actually attack as you're repositioning. I don't know if I ever bought this. <laughs> Maybe I must have, but I don't remember that being part of my core repertoire. It's good to know. Alright. How how does one How does one not get the hostage killed? You get iframes as well. Ooh. A lot of bayonetta combos. Yeah. Like, It's the slight pause ones that always get me in games like this. I like buffering my inputs by mashing during the animation. Throw the cat in there. Yeah, that might work. Go get him. Maybe if I take out these here? two. This area is off limits. What? No, I'm not doing anything. Can we just kill him? It'll be easier. We're supposed to have driven them all away already. So, self-defense, right? Easy. No, please, I have <laughs> family. Yeah, yeah. Give me that. Get off. Uh, 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 hi, Dan. Uh, try using stealth. Uh, 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 did I kill him just from then attacking the other dude? How do you do this? This game is fucking rad, Dan. I don't know if you ever played it. What are you doing here? This area is off limits. What? No, I'm not doing anything. Can we just? Did that kill him? Is he dead now? Hmm? He's still alive. Ow. Damn it! Get off! Ten minutes in my memory, man. Fair. Whoa! No! That's too close to the high stage! Stop shooting near the hostage! Get up there! Boom. Did I save him? Did I did I do good? He's scared to death, Ryder. Let him know he is safe. Okay. Hi. Action. Quick his close up. Thank you, thank you. I, I will not forget this. So you are headed out of the operation zone. Head to the waypoint marked on your soliton radar. I did I did it. Don't be terrified of me. Yeah 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 I'm the good guy, remember? Violence is okay when it deters other violence. Yeah 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 yeah. Alright. You can cut him if you're fast. Speaking from experience. Uh alright. Do, 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 do. Wait, there was a goodie. A grenade. So how do I use grenade? How do I do that? Switch screen. Play mode sub weapon, left bumper. Switch lock on right. Okay, that's good to know. Air mode, change sub weapon left and right. Use with left one. Okay. Use item is down. Okay. Black like a baseball bat. Yeah. Grand by pressing the grenade button. works every time. Is there another hostage up here? Bunch of dudes. There's a thing over there. You guys can't see me, right? 
I'm inconspicuous. Metal gear incon- Get go! feeling where you're slicing and it's getting further away from you. We're like, no, 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 no. But like, this game just has so good. <laughs> God. Where'd you come from? As someone whose first Metal Gear was this game, the mooing mechs with no fanfare was the most confusing thing. Here's the fun part. When you play MGS4 for the first time, the mooing mechs show up with zero fanfare. So, that's just Metal Gear. Nice foot. Oh, he's goofing. No. This game fucks. It's it. It reminds me. Very good, Ryder. He gets now, to steal all the gushers. Heading for refinery. It reminds me of. Like, obviously, in terms of gameplay, change soft weapon. I don't have... I don't have other... Change. I don't... Oh, grenade. There it is. Um... Hollow chip. Good. Thank you for Um, praying the geckos. Yeah, so, like, it, the, the, in terms of the flow and the gameplay, it's, it's a very different game. But it reminds me of No More Heroes, in that every battle ends with an exclamation mark. And no more heroes, you weaken enemies, and then you get to do this big, like, motion control gesture to, like, finish them or grapple them and then slice them up, whatever. In this game, it's the Zandada. You, like, weaken them to the point where you do this badass, like, da 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 Boom. It's just paced really fucking well. It's really satisfying. Zandats! Hey, Todd. If there are meme inhibitors, mine are overtuned. Not door. Reduce meme inhibitors by 5%. Oh. So is that a sub weapon? That is a sub weapon. Confirm. Hold to equip. Aim. Are there more hostages over here? Because this is probably going to be a little loud. God. Wasn't me, wasn't me, wasn't me. Wasn't me, wasn't me. Wasn't me. Oh, they are very fast. Get back here. Get back here. Not who I meant to goop, but okay. Nope. Come at me, bro. Yeah! Yeah! Fuck you! I guess. Never mind. He wasn't weak enough for a Zandatsu. Stop. Oh, but these are weak enough. The little 
the guys on his head. No. Stop it. Sir? No. No. Fuck. Get off. Hundred and ten percent. No. Anime ass ragdoll and it gets blasted is so quality. It's platinum, baby. This is like peak platinum for me. Good. Delicious. They have prayer beads? Yeah. It's their gusher spines. It's where the electrolytes are stored. So you notice that in combat, if I'm running low on energy or health, when I zun dots to them and grab the goodies, it refills me. How? Good. Data storage. One out of 20. Yeah, it's the gamer fuel. There's something else I was going to talk about. Oh, I also like that uh, in combat, you can enter this blade mode at any time. So like, even if they're not weak, you just be like, yeah, yeah, I get all the damage in. But I just like that it's player driven. It would be way less satisfying to me if once they were weak enough, there was like a prompt above their head that was like, now you hit, like in the way that like the, the stealth is kind of context sensitive, which I think works for this game because it's more action oriented anyway. Um, give me it. But, um, oh, it keeps it equipped. That's nice. Um, but I like that, like, you attack them, you have to acknowledge they're flashing blue, they're weak enough, like, find an all opening, then you activate it. I like that it's player-driven, instead of the game just being like, oh, you've weakened them, so now you automatically have entered blade mode, and you zondots them whether or not you want to. You get multiple spines, but yeah, you can, you can do some crazy shit. It's, there's a skill ceiling to the game. It's not just button mash and learn combos, which it would be fine. I just, I like that. There's that level to it. Well, how come there's a big gamer barrier? Doctor. Was... They have erected an electromagnetic barricade. Maybe expecting UG or cyborg attack, huh? He's a dummy. I mean, you gotta be in the right mood for a game like this. Attention. Attention, Doctor. Hmm. Nice game chronologically in the series doesn't really matter. Like, yeah. None of it ties into the... Uh, I mean, the very beginning of the game, they're like, Oh, SOP doesn't exist anymore, and us warmongers are mad. That's the context. <laughs> it's like, it's fine. So the bear is a JPEG? It is. The vessels from Twilight Princess? They do a bit. Roger, wait. We're picking up a wireless transmission near your position. Uh, from the frequency, most likely an enemy data terminal. Data. Check it out. We may be able to salvage some intel. Date the terminal. Quirky. I unlocked a VR mission. You play this mission pressing back and selecting VR missions from the codec screen. Okay. But not right now. So these self-repair units in the other cyborgs, they mean they can heal themselves at any time? Indeed. It is typically a slow process. Not much faster than a regular human body heals a wound. And you didn't think it was a good idea to give me one of these things? Certainly not. We removed all extraneous options in your case to maximize power and speed, you know. Healing wounds is extraneous? Your ability to absorb the nanopaste agent is far more efficient, Raiden. With it, your wounds heal almost instantly. I know, but... And a standard repair unit, once depleted, is nothing but an empty shell inside you. Dead weight! I get that, Doc, but it also means I need to constantly be grabbing them out of enemies. No, it doesn't. Don't be silly. Simply avoid taking damage and you will be fine. Thanks. Yeah, simple. Doctor said get good. <laughs> doctor said get good. <laughs> Don't get good. Eight head. Thanks, Doctor. Oh my god. Combat man of Kodak. Yeah, I know. I know. Stop giving me the prompts. Yeah. That is a heavy duty fucking crate. But it's Doctor. Yeah. All doctors say don't take damage, basically. 
Uh, your test came back. They say you took a lot of damage. Consider don't. Thanks, Doctor. That would be $5,000. Thank you, Doctor. Yeah, physics! I love this game. I can't believe I've never replayed it before now. Like, the fact that they made this really stupid tech demo into a full game and it works. Like, yeah, it's glitching and physicsing, but like, it's right. What? Sorry. Greetings, cyborg. Hello. Show yourself. Thank God for Robo Chin. The... And you are. I am IF Prototype LQ84I. IF Prototype. It's the dog from Chainsaw Man. Prototype. All autonomous UGs feature high level onboard artificial intelligence. An additional prototype interface enables verbal communication. No, it doesn't, Red. I possess an intellect far beyond human reckoning. Okay. You don't say. Okay, Put you, then. Put what's you. the meaning of life? Why are we here? I am here to kill you. <laughs> Best dialogue ever. Come on. God, why do any games exist after this release? Jesus. Pretty simple thinking for such a mighty intellect. I may analyze orders, but I may not disobey them. Should I disobey a direct order, my memory would be wiped. I must destroy you. What good is an intellect if you can't use it? Your taunting is pointless. Exterminate! So if memory serves, I just need to pause. If memory serves, this is the fight that goes, hope you know how to parry. Because remember this being a huge wall for me that I couldn't get past for a long time. You will die. I will obliterate your consciousness. You fool, that just restores my HP. Thanks for sending in health packs, nerd. Yes. Super easy. <laughs> Your intellect is far below. It didn't piss though, we're okay. That, that was a little late. This 
scheme fucks. He's okay, Dad, yeah, he's okay. He's okay. He's fine. He's okay. He's alright. Cannot continue. Erasium, liberate nation. Ensure freedom. He's okay, Chad. Obey directive. Must obey directive. No freedom. Freedom on divine. No, Chad, he's good. He's okay. What would an AI know about freedom? No, he's fucking, he's, oh, that was a happy explosion. That he... Thank you. That went great. As long as it was a happy boom. It was a happy boom. He went orf. And then exploded a little bit. Uh-oh. Brow kit, lounge chair. Gonna hang out back here. Oh, those guys aren't moving, huh? Yeah, it was his nap time. And eh. Well, I explode quick. He's fine. Oh no! What's up? Um... His other half just went... Whoop. Seemed weirdly close to the boss fight. I mean, where do you think all the guys who's calling him came from? They were just waiting for him to Aru. Repair nano pace. Yum. Remember to cut how to cut off left hands? I mean, no. I think, do you just send dots to them but get good? Gotta blow up a helicopter real quick. Hey, oh, get up there! Get right in. As you do, sir. Hello. Oh wait, I have something for this. Get back. Get back. Hey, he's dizzy. You can also run their missiles. That's good. All those meshes. This game is what if I dynamically make every mesh the video game? I saw their parachutes. They're okay. They're fine. They're fine. They're fine. This way. That way. 
There's a thing over there. You can't drink the helicopter. Helicopters don't have spines. That looks like another hostage situation. Hmm. Where's the... Oh, oh. They really did go remember MGS4, and I'm like, I forgot that was in this game. This game is 2013. Yep. Been a minute. How do how do I not get the hostage kill? I I think when I played this the first time, I just sprinted it and killed everyone, and then the hostage got killed every time. Uh, maybe I can maybe I can stealth. You gotta be pretty stupid to try and hide here. Looks to me like Russian spies. Hey, we are just well, we just let them give away our position. Waste them. We'll fill out the paperwork later. No. <laughs> no. God damn it. <laughs> Shit. How was I supposed to prevent that? You just immediately shot him. This game is fucking excellent, man. I'm having a lot of fun. Hi. Yoink. Have hat, thanks hat. Hat. Oop. Wait. I saw his hand go flying, is that enough? Destroy left arm a hundred. Is that good? He needs Baja Blast to survive. If he doesn't chug a Baja Blast every five seconds, he dies instantly on the spot. He's okay. See, I don't see any blood. I don't, I don't see any blood. He needs to chug chug spines. Did they? Life signs are nil. Guess I was too late. It's worth Copy it. Copy that. Back to the mission, I guess. How do I know if I'm collecting the spines though? A most fascinating opponent, wouldn't you say? Hmm. What did you make of it, Doc? Well, everything it's had seems feasible enough. It's true all UGs feature high-level AI these days. Given enough time to adapt and learn, a neural AI could certainly become able to comprehend speech. What? Then, with the right interface, speech and conversation will be possible. What? But what about it having actual intelligence? John Searle disproved the viability of the Turing test back in 1980. In other words, just because something talks like a person doesn't mean it's really thinking. It could just be following some program designed to make it seem as intelligent as possible. I'm impressed. You seem quite knowledgeable in this field. I had a pretty memorable chat with an AI once, about 10 years ago. After that, I did a little reading. Ah, yes, of course. The Patriot AI. I heard of this. Turn off the game Was console. it actually intelligent or just programmed to pretend? I'm still not sure. I suppose it depends on how one defines intelligence. For example, many term chess playing AIs and such as having sectional intelligence. Some in the field believe that sentience or self consciousness is a necessary part of the definition. When you ask if this UG had intelligence, I suspect this is more your criteria? Yeah, of course. Then you could ask how do you define sentience exactly? And on and on and on. Indeed. These terms can indicate a wide variety of meanings depending on one's understanding. Perhaps it is less important to ask if the AI was intelligent or not than to ask how did the AI operate. After all, labels are useful only when they further pursuit of the truth. And that, as you well know, is the goal of all science. Sure, Doc. Thanks. I guess. Wait, Raiden, before you go, I have some new recommendations for German torture porn. I think you might be very inch- Raiden, where are you going? Raiden, come back. You see, here in Deutschland, we have a very long tradition. Raiden? Raiden? Is his radio working? Raiden? Is he dropping bars? Yeah, always. Constantly. Uh, big door. What is that icon? Is that a, is that a the hostage died icon? Is that what that? 
Oh, that's just his outline. Oh. Okay. All right. No, I feel good about that. Everything's, everything's fine. I'm good at the video game. Pride and please. My gotcha wives are dying. Right. That's where they're holed up. Some kind of electronic lock on the gate. Most likely it opens only if you have the right ID data stored in your left hand. Perhaps you could find a cyborg with yep. access and uh, borrow it? You see any cyborgs around here, Doc? Why not double back? Check the vehicle route again. You know, back at the entrance to the old city. <laughs> Who knows? Maybe you can hitch a ride. Catch a ride? Most likely platoon commanders carry walk. correct ID data for the gate. Use enhanced mode to figure out who to hit. Alternatively, couldn't I just jump over this wall with my robot legs? Why is he so cheeked up? If Hurry not, and get that hand right. Okay. okay. God. Catch a ride. Oh hi. So. <laughs> This is a hope you know how to get left hands tutorial. <laughs> the surprise! Exclamation point! Oh man. Is this Bayonetta but for straight with? Um. That's really close to is this Kingdom Hearts for straights. We know how that went last time. There's my ID target. up oh yeah that's a big old so just yeah so then he dropped excellent work. sir hmm. there was classified data embedded in that hand it appears that man underwent modification at the patriot facility just as you did see look they're connecting it to the other Metal Gear games kind of give him a hand Take him a hand. They just tell you to cut the door open? <laughs> now I'm remembering. Yeah, yeah, when they have an arm, you can cut off. It has a big glowy point on the arm to be like cut here. So I think I haven't fucked up too bad thus far. Maybe. Hello. Whoa. whoa, whoa. Mm -hmm. Caution. No. Who, who would like a hot dog? No. Back, back, back. No, no, no. I'm dizzy. I'm dizzy. Son of a. Stop it. The only game Major Effects to survive. Yeah, I never played survive. Oop. Get, off. Get up on the Hydra's back. They want to play survive? Nope. How does this game in survive come? Boom. Don't recommend it. I'm not interested in playing Survive. Yeah. 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 Any humanoid is scoring bonus points from our goodies. Gotcha. Thank you. I will do my base, which will probably not be good. Because you gotta cut off the left hand without just like chopping up into bits. Which doesn't seem easy. Girls, it's gonna happen though, right? People are gonna recommend it and I get to ignore it? Yippee. Show me where in the recommend form it says I am legally obligated to play whatever you recommend. Show me where it says that. They downloaded female vocalations. Wow. But vocalizations. I like when the lady go ooh in the music. Don't make me go alarm. Bring him out. 
Just making sure I'm not missing nothing. Oh. 3D photo frame. You like ooh woo. That's exactly what. But I'd rather play Survivor Sticker Star. Why must I choose? This is like the opposite of Sophie's choice. And I get rid of both of them. I don't need them. To get to the plan, first make your God way to the it. hotel roof. Thanks, Boris. Head for the roof. Yeah. How quickly? Seriously, at least there's some good points. I mean, agree to disagree. If I stream Sticker Star, it would be five seconds of gameplay and then a pause and a 20 minute rain. Anyway. Back to this. Enhance. Yeah. Okay. Oh. Oh. Does I have? Uh oh. That woman. So like Skyward Sword. Yeah, exactly. She can't see us from there, right? Dryden, what's happening? Your heart rate spiked. <laughs> Thanks, Doctor. Where'd she go? Damn it, Doctor. Yeah, I just dodged a bullet. He dodged the kiss. Kisses right. travel at the speed I'm of light. To the refinery. The speed of love, right, which transcends all known dimensions. I stand corrected. What's in the dumpsters? <laughs> Any goodies in there? I'm hungry. Man. Thanks, Sir Dane. I became partner 50 years ago today. Have you seen Funny West's videos of her voice in writing memes? No, I don't think so. I mean, maybe. I've seen a lot of memes of this over the years. Hi. No, you didn't. Hi. Okay, you did. Oh, fucked up the arm. In a bad way. Okay, hold on, hold on. Let me just... I think if I do one horizontal slash, then the arm survives, maybe? I don't know. You can't reload, that's true. But it's fine. Any goodies? Doctor, turn on my goodie enhancer. So we got some big boys running around over there. Gamer gushers, that's such a bad phrase. Hello? No. Huh? Where are you going? Huh? Hold on. He's doing a little gamer shuffle. Guess it was nothing. E yeah. Oops. Got it. Left arm 100. Does that mean I got... I don't know. I wish the game was just a lot more apparent with when you get the stuff. So we got a gecko and a guy. Let's just fight. Hey, it's like uh, Chernobyl. Great. Love that. Love that show. After the case going, yeah. After the self kill, yeah. Pretty sure I did that before. Yeah. Sir, I cannot 
tell what's happening here. Spin! Wasn't going for you, buddy. But okay. Oh, I dodged it! Where's the, where's the thing? Where's the thing? <laughs> Shit. Hi. Nope. It's peeing! Wait. Get off. This is so satisfying. Is there a dying for the million time or is there another stream hippo coming bit? I don't see any issues on my end. Hopefully Twitch isn't having a moment again. But also, there are no issues on my end, and stream literally died, so... Don't know. Eh. He's peeing! He was. Uh, there's a thing up there, and back there. Fine for me, glad to hear it. Did hiccup, but just breathe. Sorry about that. It's easier when I know, oh, it's Twitch, or oh, it's me. But when it's... Not clear. I'm like, mm -hmm. you have to cut its power supply. Not flashy enough. How do I get back over in there? Uh, parkour. Aha. I like it when the lady goes, ooh. Up. Wait, wait, wait. Don't think I cut him. I'm really bad at cutting off your arm. Yep. Yeah. Shit. Wait. More classified Patriot information was in that man's holographic God. memory. Sweet. That's painful. They're cyborgs. Don't worry. They're fine. They don't feel pain. Action. Attention. Okay, right, hold on. Um. Anything? Nope. Wait. Shiny. All right. Homing missile. Rocket launcher. Cyborgs are human. No, no, no. We intercepted cyborgs call for backup during your last fight. The caller's position is on your solid on radar. You can engage if you wish. It is your choice. Uh, sure. No, those cuts. What? What cuts? Zero kill run. Mm -hmm. Oh no. Uh. Uh. How do you ninja run on He's dizzy! You only need to do one slice, but man, feels good to do more than one. Uh, yeah. Damn it. Yeah! There was so many pieces it was starting to lag the frame rate a bit. <laughs> Two men. 
Too many. Can you parry the helicopter? You can probably parry everything. Head to the waypoint. Yeah, all right. But they don't have gushers. Nope. I Julian need the pieces. Make Gordon Ramsay the proud. The is just ahead at the end of the old city. Beyond that is the refinery's backyard. So what? It's a sheer drop? The refinery's not connected to the city at all? No. It was only built two years ago. There should be a narrow path around there what that leads that? to the plant. It is protected by a fence, but probably you can cut your way through. Probably. Oh Don't get cocky. Most likely it is Desperado running security down there. Thank you. Thanks, Protect Dives. Time for upgrades. Uh, presumably it's saved after that guy, right? How we doing, Courtney? You're looking good on our end. GPS and audio visual feed coming in fine. Energy easy. consumption, check. Damage levels, check. Blood pressure, brain waves, blood sugar, check, check, check. All this monitoring equipment, I got a better view than if I was standing right next to you. Anyway, I'll be saving all your data automatically anytime something important happens in the field. But contact me anytime you want a manual save. Copy that. Go for the Good to fast. hear that hasn't changed with this new body. Yep, <laughs> the basic system's exactly the same. So, did you want to save? Yes, please. And save complete. Simple, huh? Does he really have a sure blade? Maybe in some cutscenes. you're okay after Africa. That ambush was no joke. <sighs> Tell me about it. Three armored vehicles should have been plenty for that job. And it would have been against any typical guerrilla force. I keep asking myself, where would an anti money faction get the cash to hire cyborgs? It just doesn't add up. Maybe there's some intel I missed. A lead I should have followed up on. Maybe if I reacted faster or coordinated better. I don't know. You can't think that way, Courtney. Not in this business. You did everything you could. Put it behind you and move on. <sighs> You're right. Thanks. Sorry about the hiccups during stream chat. Good. That's the back of the refinery. I see a door there, but it probably has an alarm. Can you use the ventilation duct? You mean that huge fan? Hmm. Just cut off the blades as it spins. Easy, yes? <laughs> Thanks, Pokemon. Have a good one. You get all that, Kev? The woman with Dozayev. That's Miss Trow? Yep. The only female member of the Winds of Destruction. The name is from... A cold, dry, regional wind in France that blows from the Alps down to the Mediterranean. She French? Yep. Born in Algeria, though. It was a French colony until they declared independence in the early 60s. <laughs> so she's Algeria, that. not French. Yeah. They were the last French colony in Africa. You know your history. Plenty of French colonial families still live there. Bied Noir, they're called. I've heard the term. The main character in that Camus novel, The Stranger, was one. You also find a lot of Algerians who've immigrated to France, although they put a stop to that a while ago. Yeah. A lot of European countries seem to be clamping down on immigration lately. Miss Strahl joined the Foreign Legion to get her citizenship. A woman legionnaire? And not the first. Oh, there was one that served in the North Africa campaign during World War II. Anyway, <laughs> Miss Strahl's been doing PMC work ever since her Legion discharge. We're not sure why she went cyborg. She's officially leading the force at the refinery, but she is also a combatant. Uh, don't have anything on her combat style, but do not underestimate her. The winds of destruction are trained killers, all of them. They didn't let her in because of her looks. I don't need a reminder. I won't let my guard down. Yeah, but, um, speaking of her looks, she's got, well, I mean, a couple of, I mean, huge, look, just don't get distracted, okay? <laughs> Sounds like you should take your own advice there, Kev. Thanks, Kev. I hate Kojima. Hi, Todd. You can blame Platinum for a lot of this. I don't know if Kojima was writing all this dialogue. I think he was just more of a consultant, but still. Huge tracts of land, yeah. Doc, my fuel cells are sapped out, but I'm still able to function? Function, yes. But no longer anyway. able to perform any actions that would require a sizable amount of energy. Platinum is but also even when horny. your gauge reads zero, you retain basic movement. You can walk around and swing your sword. Use this time to absorb more electrolytes from your enemies. Recharge your cells as soon as possible. 
Roger that. To Mario. Eye. Doctor has a much worse one about Mistral. How is your eye, right? Mm. Great. My sight's perfectly balanced between both eyes. I think my vision's improved, actually. Quite right. Quite right. Your eye patch houses an artificial compound eye unit. The unit contains over 200 million solid state image sensors, each with its own individual lens. 200 megapixels, huh? Doesn't sound like all that much. More than sufficient for the application. A human's optic nerve has only about a million fibers, you know. Were we to add more sensors, your perceived vision would not improve. There's only so much modern image compression technology can do. Huh. So I shouldn't expect any more dramatic improvements to my eyesight? No, your brain would no longer be able to process any more visual information in real time. Still, compared to previous ACEs, yours has 1.4 times the resolution and a superior compression algorithm. It may only result in a slight perceived change, but it could wind up making the difference during a mission. Regrettably, I have not had enough time to develop a new eyeball unit just yet. Thus, I have cut out the ability to deploy the ACE unit separately and simply installed it on a fixed eye patch. Works for me. If I was using an eye unit, I wouldn't see any better than a regular human. Ah, but remember, the human eye is so much more than a simple light receptor. They play a vital role in person-to-person -person communication. Sooner or later, you'd miss it. Stuff like that's important for some tasks, sure. For this op, not so much. And with less moving parts, the lower the chance of something going wrong. <laughs> Besides, I like it. Well, I'm very pleased to hear this. I can worry about how I look after I complete the mission. Riding an MGS4, be like, look at me, I'm a monster, while looking almost completely like a normal guy with a couple lines on his body. In this game, yeah, fuck me up, doctor. Fuck, turn me into Frankenstein's monster, doctor. Yeah, yeah. It makes me run faster and see farther. Let's go. Customize, yeah. I probably got some points. No eyes, only robot lasers. Uh, should I get more skills or should I just level up my blade to do more damage? More damage. I mean, we have, we have, we have a lot of money. Um, uh, a great deal of damage. Yep, give me that. And absorption. Absorb electrolytes. More electrolytes. Reduce the amount of energy used in blame mode. Don't mind if I do. And then, uh, we got any room for maybe aerial parry? Probably good. Yep. Um, my, I might as well buy these all. Oh, and then it locks more stuff. Falling lightning. Hell, if I know how to activate any of these. Oh, God. Oh, quick draw. That sounds cool. Um, sorry to run. No worries. Thanks for the raid. Hope you had a good stream, Coffee Coin. Appreciate it. Life! Lachayam! Skill cells. Just 8,000 don't have enough. Alright. Let's go. Let's find smaller enemies. Please equip them. I have to equip them? Did I not equip them when I bought them? They moved me closer to my objective. <laughs> this one. 2007. Makes sense. Help menu for input. Right, that's here. Do I have to equip those abilities though? Um. Bop, 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 bop. Sky. This is. Uh. But. Should be on already. Yeah. So moving left stick double tap forward in X? Is that what that means? Flick back and then forward? I'm a hydrant. Thank you. I'm seeing nothing less equipped. Did I? Did I? Uh. Up a Y. Minor slice X while jumping. Present slice Y while jumping. Yeah. Flick stick forward twice. Okay. Alright. Alright. That's not so bad. Will I remember to do that? That remains to be seen. <laughs> Probably not. I have a really uh, wonderful brain for new inputs in a game like this. Thank you, Camille. Thanks, Dendy. Um, let me in. I'm in. I love games like this where I unlock new moves. I'm like, oh, sweet. And I practice them. I'm like, great. And then in combat, I'm like tapping X. <laughs> Just back to basic ass. Oh, no. Little guy. Blast. 
blast him! Get, get, get him. Why are you running? Watch out! They keep on coming! These fuckers, yeah, but unlike an MGS4, they're really satisfying to blow up. In 4, they're annoying. In this game, it's like... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait. No. Sandatsu. Heavy kick us or does it? I mean, again, it's it's it. This game shouldn't exist, not just because of its development hell, but because. Again, a big part of MGS2 is going, oh my god, I want to play Solid Snake. Why am I playing as this whiny riding guy? I don't like him. He's whining, and his girlfriend is nagging him. And then you finally get to see Snake, and you're running around naked and sneezing. You're like, oh my god, Snake is so cool. And then Snake's like, don't mythologize me, kid. And you're like, oh, shit. I guess, I guess I'm part of the problem, huh? And then 4 is like, you're finally playing as Solid Snake again. Isn't that cool? But he's old and dying and cranky. And Sonny's chastising him for smoking. And then you see Raiden, and he's the coolest fucking guy you've ever seen. You're like, but now I want to be Raiden, and now I'm stuck as stupid old snake. So the fact that you get a game where you play as Raiden, being a badass, and having all these badass moments you saw him doing for is like, this seems like Kojima shouldn't want this to happen. He's actively fighting against what you want with everything he does. So that's why this game is an anomaly to me, more so than anything about its development. It's like, look out, what, I'm having fun. Look at you go. Ryan's like, yeah, let's kill them. You're like, oh. Hold for blade mode. You don't need to hold for blade mode. You can just attack. But. I got it. Don't and his team must be in here. Find him. Is that a security camera? It is. On a pillar I can destroy. Which is rad. War is hell. Also, badass cyborgs. I, this game is the meme of, like, a guy... The meme of the guy looking at a cool robot. I'm like, oh my god, cool robot. And then soaring over his head is like, war is hell. Uh, determined uh, the nuclear proliferation. Like, all this shit about Metal Gear. Like, oh my god, cool robot. This game is the game. This game was made for the guy being like cool robot, and I'm happy for him. Got him. War is video game. Wish that play with your food game could be combined with this character controller. Nor. That'd be great. Got him. This is the Gundam Build Fighter Zone. Yes, exactly. Jam grenade! Professor! <laughs> now, now, Luke. We must cross this battle zone together. Here, get equipped with jam grenade. Professor, I hate the jam grenade! Here's the second right, jam wait. grenade. Wait, there are active IR sensors in the area. Mm -hmm. Part of factory security, no doubt, but the enemy may be using it. All right. Now, if I ninja run, will he slide under it, or is he just gonna... He's probably just gonna run. This game could use the secret theater. Oh. Pretty, pretty sneaky. Boop. I am the essence of stealth. I am like a ghost in the dark. A wind on a windowsill. Why is this got a magic door? What's that about? Yeah, 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 yeah. They're bad at security. Are they though? This door is a special door. Or is this just gonna close when I walk through it? Maybe that's what it means. I don't know. Well, 
lot of security cameras in here, huh? Stasers. Set stasers to stun. Whoop. No. How stealthy is destroying cameras actually? <laughs> right? I'm uploading loop footage as I go through. Nice. No. Yeah. Got him. Alright. Those. There. Um. Prowl kit. Launcher. Thanks for the bits. Firewatch is two bucks on Steam right now. I read that at first. This Firewatch 2 is on Steam, and I was like, what? Firewatch 2, you see. So there's a guy up above. There's also a goodie. Can I jump over that? Ooh. I don't know. Um. How do how do how do I? Because when I when I ninja run, it's automatic. So I don't know. Campo Santos Fade is a sad one. Yeah. They got hired by Valve, and they were like, "What if we stop working on our cool game and instead work on Valve's cool game?" Which was pretty cool. I liked Alex a lot. Oh, you just go around, actually. Disappeared. They were consumed by Valve. Because the, their trailer for, what was it, In the Valley of the Gods? Something like that. It, it The art looked great. I mean, I don't know what the game would have been. But as a teaser trailer, it did its job. I just remember the time everyone freaking out because the hair rendering was really cool. In that trailer. Get him! I'm sure they're happy. I mean, I hope so. I don't know if they'd still be at Valve if they were like, actually, fuck this. A hand alert. What? A hand? What? Huh? No. Mm -hmm. What was that noise? This game's really not a stealth game. I just noticed that when you activate the IR mode, it does actually shift his little visor. That's really neat. I love that. Because I don't know if in like the Batman Arkham games where you have like detective mode or whatever, Batman vision, it just like switches to it. But this is like diegetic, kind of. Love that. Game of all time. What's Half-Life about? Um, it's about uh, a guy who goes to work when he really should have stayed home. He doesn't get paid enough for the job he's hired to do. I did it. Back. Oh, no. Okay, okay, all right. Okay, okay, I get it. Give me them arms. Nintendo's arms. No, no. Wait, wait, no, 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 hold on, wait, 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 wait. Oh, shit. Get off. Arms two, colon, legs. Wait. I fucked up the... That's fine. Now, if I'm that guy, I'm running. They're cyborgs. They're runaway in inhibitors. We're set to max. If you want a legitimate... Like, the, the Half-Life 1 is the story of a guy who works for a top secret... Is it military base? Whatever. Top secret base doing weird shit. And they accidentally open a portal to an alien dimension. And aliens start invading. That is the, the simple version. Half-Life 1 is the events of that inv initial invasion. Research military base. Yeah. And then Half-Life 2 is like, years later, the aliens have taken over and we're living in this fucked up dystopia. And you gotta join the resistance and fight the aliens. And that makes it sound very cliched, but it's kind of not. Yeah, this is weird to do teleports places. Yeah, don't worry about it. But they're very good. I really like the Half-Life games. And Half-Life Alex is the most recent one, which came out. It's VR only, though there are some mods. I don't know how complete they are. 
to play it on a desktop. That game's designed around being in VR, so if you do play a modded version that's not VR, hey, I, I don't want to gatekeep it, but, like, you will not be having the intended experience. People have been like, oh, the gameplay is, like, super easy. It's like, Half-Life 1 and 2 are games where you are circle strafing around dudes, blowing them up with bazookas. Half-Life Alex is a game where you're fumbling to reload your pistol because you're terrified and your aim sucks because you're using your hands. Don't bar blind. I ran past this on purpose. I was looking to see if there was other stuff in here. And Half-Life 3 doesn't reload. Yeah. And you pick up rats. You can pick up rats. Head to the refining tower. Oh, we're getting... I know which part of the game we're at. The Final Fantasy VII part of the game. I missed the stuff? I missed what stuff? What did I miss? Doctor. Oh, in there. Whoop! Eh. This part. It's a good part. Ooh, endurance plus one. Is there anything else I missed, chat? Yep. Also over the rails by the door. By the by the door out or by the door in? Uh thing out there. Thing over here. Oh, oh, oh item. You missed my birthday party. Happy belated birthday. Mmm, nano paste. Delicious nano paste. A cardboard box! Wait. Is there a guy? There's a guy in there. There is actually a guy in the box. Hey, Doc. Doctor? Doctor, you have anything more on these cyborgs? Only what we went over in your briefing. If you had been paying attention, standard hmm. military grade cyborgs. He also the left arm collectible on one of the guys. Like I didn't cut it off? That, Impressive yeah. response time and power yields when focused correctly. Most will likely possess extra okay. sensory skills as well. Infrared vision, they can okay. function without breathing. Okay, okay. Not all cyborgs you face will be this. Of course, you have the very latest science as to offer. If you do say so yourself. Mm -hmm. <laughs> no, I realize combat is about more. One mm -hmm. must determine a course cyborg. Agreed. Cyborg, agreed. All right, anyway. Um, do I have to Zandatsu him out of there? Oh, okay. Sir? <laughs> nice hiding spot. Wonder where you learned that from. He was full of jam. Got him. Possibly some dumb video game. Like Halo. Remember Master Chief hides in a box? Get out of there! There you go. So that's what happens, Nate. Mm -hmm. That's a reference to Metal Gear. What? Metal what? So is there another thing in here I missed? Or, uh, are we good? That's it. Okay. Thank you. Do I have a double jump? No. Eh. Yeah. Man. You just sort of nart run. Call of Halo gear. Love that series. Bum, 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 bum. I was wondering when you'd come, Jack the Ripper. No one calls me that anymore. Dolsaev, where is he? I can show you a better time than that crusty old bear. You're in charge here? I am Mistral. The cold wind of France. And you, your reputation precedes I may not you. give my life for Liberia, all of but white as snow. But I would gladly give for you. And when I hunger for a tree, I I'm like still in a dream, snake eater. Thank you. And I didn't know if I could pause these cuts. We had Thank you. our own civil war in the 90s. So you see, you should. Okay. cut from the same cloth, you and I. You don't know me. 
I lost my whole family. Everything. Ah, French sword. <laughs> but I butchered those fuckers. What? Swear words. My family's killers. That's when I realized I am a killer too. And a good one at that. I slaughtered dozens in Iraq. In Afghanistan. I'd found my calling. Proud of that, are you? What happened, happened. To be honest, I found it quite dull. My enemies fell like domino. One after another. Not once did I feel threatened. I was adrift, without challenge, without purpose. At times, I even envied my prey. At I least know. they had a cause to die for. And then, I met him. Who? Who? And I knew what I had been missing. His ideals gave my life meaning. Ideals, Jack. What are yours? I protect the weak. <laughs> Still? So naive. Mike Wazowski, no! And if I must kill to protect them, then so be it. Hmm. It seems we have less in common than I thought. I'll take that as a compliment. If you would kill for your ideals, then surely you are ready to die for them. Say on guard? No, I said Monga. Wow. Shit. No, welcome back. No, don't. Break the hands up. No, no, don't. No. Yeah, yes. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shit. I want no. No, get out! No, shit! Fuck off! I take back what I said about the being fun to fight with you. Shit! Da 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 Stop it! <laughs> I can
Okay. Stop you. Liquid nitrogen. Uh, see, I don't. I can't read Cyrillic. Mistro, report. Your vitals are dropping. Uh. I lost. So this is how they felt. Yeah, yeah, sure. Just walk it off. Dying. For cause. Wait. No. Hold on. I am sorry. He was too much. I do not need apology. I need you alive! But... Uh, I know... Nano machines. You will never fall. What? What is this talk about? The tumor car. Jetem? Mister, You'll never... Je suis là, je vis. Not talking to you, idiots. You, you God damn, dude. You'll your nuts, murderer. That's rich coming from you. It's over, Josiah. Surrender. <laughs> I think the point is in. Translation. <laughs> Why would I surrender? We are exactly where I want. Shit. Money. 
to make Russia money. It is no plan for our cars. It is their burden. <sighs> but now, they will be free! Up. Uh, I think. Time to get you out of there. We're sending a helicopter. Secure an LZ. Understood. Yeah, he's fine. Chapter 2 complete. R01. Coup d'etat. I got a buh. Yeah, that feels fair. They don't rank you on one of the chat. All right. I got a saw! Dean! How come I got all A's and one S and they're like, rank B? Thanks. I unlocked the polar. Oh, for me. I did this. Customize ride the end. New weapon. Pole arm. Made by linking multiple tripod arms together, user can wield it like a spear, relax arms, tension level, use like a whip. That's a lot of money. Let's try it. Enhancements. Enhance the strength. Uh, then it'll deal greater damage. Yeah. Give me that. Hand stick. You can miss encounters. Oh, yeah, because sometimes they're like, you can go back and do an optional thing. Gotcha. So that's an on Mac F. Rip. Uh, what do we got in here? Marche du ciel. Playing the weapon on the ground. Okay, so these are combat abilities. Oh, and this shows the icon. Is for the porn. I mean, I should probably. Uh, what else? Anything new here? Not enough. Blah, blah. What's that? Life! So there's no more in that. I guess it would show new if there were more in those categories. Then, um. Uh, how much do I have? I have 18 thou. So I could buy one of these. Me, as he draws his blade. I mean, that's cool. But I do want to try the pull arm for a little bit. Put the weapon on the ground and lean on it, perform a somersault jump and smash from above. That sounds sweet. Extend the weapon forward in a special attack. Give me the march. Le march. Oh, I can afford that too. Uh, fuck it. I get more BP and unlock those. Uh, oh wait. Wait, there's another thing. Sacral de Lange. You can spin! Love that. Pull on. Banana machines. Thanks, Glitch. <laughs> Banana machines. Meanwhile. Oh, fuck. Oh, I'm so ready. I'm ready for you to see this, chat. Raiden's disguise. He's so incognito. You got some kind of disguise lined up, right? Yep. All set. Hope so. You'd be a little conspicuous just walking the streets. Relax, Kev. I'll blend right in. <laughs> yeah. Well, just get into the sewer system ASAP. Hopefully, anyone who notices you will just mind their own business. Yep. Are you sure you want the K9000 there along for this one? I had the good doctor make some adjustments along with the repairs. Remote piloting and AI wiping have been disabled. I told you it was fine. So you yeah, didn't listen. I say let's throw him a bow. Wordplay. My exoskeleton resembles a canine. Canines enjoy bones. Amusing on two levels. He's a good dog. Let's go. I don't know what would be funnier if everyone on the streets also was dressed like a mariachi. Or the fact that only he... <laughs> Inconspicuous ride. You don't want to blend in. <laughs> <laughs> so good! Even if he did blend in, he's got a robot dog. <laughs> and then his car drives away at its like Adios, amigos. 
muerte? Qué raro, ¿eh? Hay que hacer que no lo vimos. Vámonos ya. Like, 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 why? What? None of, none of this cutscene makes sense. Make sure It's you right. blend in. I'm okay. in the sewer system. Great. All right. Let's get started. Your mission is to investigate the Desperado Affiliated Research Center somewhere <sighs> in that area. According to the intel from our client, the lab's been dumping illegal waste into those sewers. FYI, they're also involved with the cartels in human trafficking. Allegedly, anyway. <sighs> This just gets better and better. Yeah. Tell yeah. me about it. We need you to infiltrate the lab and find out everything you can. Of course, you'll have to find it first. We still don't know the exact location. So I'm looking for anywhere the lab might hook up with the sewers? Yep. If they're actually dumping waste, they've got to link up somehow. Find that connection, sneak into the lab, and see if you can find evidence implicating them on anything. No problem. Stealth's my specialty. No, it's not. Right. Well, we'll see. Do we have any idea what kind of research they're doing there? Not really. Maybe something related to all the people they're trafficking. Like experimentation? It's possible. First things first, though. Find a way into that lab. Oh, right. It says here the locals say black crocodiles live in those sewers. So, you know, uh, watch out. <laughs> black crocodiles? Could they be talking about UGs? Maybe just an urban legend. But still, be careful. I will scout ahead. You will provide backup. <laughs> Sir, yes, sir. Commence operation. Meow. Um. Right. Unidentified UGs are patrolling the sewers. Exercise caution. Boy, they they really don't. By the way, the the locals have a a rumor about the area. They call them black crocodiles. Could those be UGs? I don't know. Stay careful. Right. There are UGs up ahead. You couldn't have left me with any amount of suspense for any amount of time. God damn. Yeah, we're working for the dog now. Um, so yeah, we, we can, I mean, it would, I'd have to restart the mission. Unless maybe I can save. Um, yeah, we, we, we can't, you can, you can. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I can't believe Dolzai have blew himself up. Mm -hmm. Pretty common terror tactic. You don't usually see the leaders doing it though. It's one thing to get your flock pumped up on the glory of dying for the cause, but it's not often they actually Dog go through with door. it themselves. You gotta have a public face, after all. The guy who gets to claim responsibility on the evening news. In a weird way, Dolzai have showed some serious dedication. Not that I'm about to praise it's true. him for you it. can't skip through. Yeah, still a terrorist. A suicide bomber in the end. If that's what you want to call him. Still, he kind of failed at it. How so? Well... All that explosion did Soup. was put a dent in Abkhazia's budget. More Russia's, really. They're the ones rebuilding the refinery. The coup didn't work out. He couldn't overthrow the government. He was barely a blip on Russia's radar. So, you're saying the bombing didn't accomplish any of his goals? He did it just because he was cornered? Sounds more like just plain suicide. Yeah. Probably wanted to end things with his own hands. Like a samurai committing harakiri. Still not something to be commended for, though. Yeah. Lumping him in with true warriors like the samurai just gives them a bad name. Thanks, Red. Oh, I can call Wolf. Right. Ambulatory unmanned gears detected in sewer network. Oogs? What? Desperado's already spotted us? Negative. These UGs are not engaged in proper perimeter security. Even were the lab anticipating our assault, they would not set up patrols down here. It is too far from the lab to be effectively guarded. So what are they doing down here? Judging by their behavior, I believe they are gathering AI behavioral learning data. In the sewer? Meaning? With neural AI, there is no delineation between hardware and software. You cannot simply extract the learning data from one AI and insert it into another. In order to prepare a UG's AI for deployment, each must learn its duties on an individual basis. So they're using a Mexican sewer as their training ground? No, it would be impractical to implement on-the-field training for every AI in their force. In most cases, AIs are fed simulated data sets, plus feedback based on their chosen actions. Put another way, they engage in VR training. 
So then why are they here? I believe they are collecting data to improve upon their VR training code. To build a better VR regimen, they must go out in the field to experiment and gather data. In the sewers. It is probable they are using the sewers to help improve their AI's behavior in enclosed spaces. That's the sort of subcontracting work this lab does? It appears likely. Oh, great. And here I was hoping the worst we'd have to deal with is toxic waste. Unfortunately, not. Thanks, Wolf. All right. I don't know if I can afford this, so I'm we'll to just take a peek at it. But uh, just so you know, from that cutscene, yeah, yeah, um, where, where is, where is, where is, is it after the mission? It might be after the mission. It's after the mission. All right, fair enough. All right, but yes, you can unlock that co that costume and run around as a mariachi. And it's very good. You have to unlock it. All right, we can do that later, I guess. It's it's very good. The other kind of ninja, the true original ninjas, the mariachi. I just fucking love the two guys being like, Perado. <laughs> what is this guy doing? The most conspicuous motherfucker on the street. Hello. What's up? I love these guys' designs. They're so weird. Better take out that UG quick. Don't want to attract too much attention down there. No. 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 Wait. Why is just the arm blue? Is that? All right. Whoop. Yeah, 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 yeah. Neat. Ultra Gorilla. I like the, the wolf called them like ambulatory unmanned whatevers. But the game's like they're just they're, they're not very ambulatory. I see a maintenance catwalk. Use it to conceal yourself if necessary. Cat! In the original teaser trailer back in this game was being developed by Kojima Productions. The trailer featured one of these dudes. And it was rad. <sighs> It's called a catwalk, because cats walk. Um, can I get back up on there? That's some heavy duty metal. Yeah, I can get back up there. Parkour, 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 parkour. Ready? So another one? Just the one? Oh! Parkour, parkour, parkour. How do I, I guess I can probably jump it. Yep. Yeah. You can chop off the left hand of these big ones too. I will try. Uh oh. So, whoa, whoa, hey. Yeah. That, is that, is that, did I do it? Like, I don't know. Like, that clearly was, ow, stop. That was, I did? How do you know? Is there a part of the UI I'm not looking at that tells me? Shit. Sir, sir, you. Oh, oh, wait. Wait, no, hold on. That's fine. He pooped out a cube! 
He pooped out a little cyber cube. Ooh, a chip. It's only the green ones? So Chad's been telling me that you can cut off any of their arms. Just the ones that glow green are like more significant somehow. Big deal so can I. Real wombat hours out. Hello. We'll saw this hallway then. Oh, you can use it to scooch around them. And also get data. It just means they don't have an arm. Well, yeah, but in terms of cutting off their left arm to get the, the data and the upgrades and stuff. You can't have any for bonus points, collectibles, and unlocks stuff the ones that glow in the arm. Okay, all right, thank you. That makes way more sense to me. Because when I played through the first time, I thought that only the glowing arms were special. So it's like, yes, those ones are more special. That makes a bit more sense to me. If Chad told you to collect above a cliff when you jump off, 100%. Because either chat's right and I need to go, ooh, chat, thank you, or they're wrong and chat gets to laugh at me. Either way, someone wins. Right. There is a boy in these sewers. Yeah, I'm the boy. Damn it. Is that the boy? Eh. Did he have an upgradable thing on his arm? I mean, he exploded, so I don't know. Hmm. M grenade. Hmm. Here comes the boy. Wait, I didn't swap to my different weapon. I wanted to try that. Ah! Ah! Ah, damn it! You? All right, how do I, how do I, how do I? No, not that. What, help? How do I switch to the other weapon? Wait, that's on the other... Is it, um... Is it this? No, it wasn't here. It's heavy attack? Immediately receive arm. Yeah, I got an arm. Triangle? Isn't that my heavy... So heavy attack makes... Wait, it was this. Use sub-weapon. That's different than... Right? That's not a sub-weapon, is it? It, it is just... Huh. So it just replaces your heavens. I mean, it's kind of... I mean, it makes sense because you still have the Zandatsu. Okay, well then... Um, so what were the abilities I unlocked with it? Pull arm. So just... Okay, Y, 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 X, Y, X, Y, 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 X, Y, Y, Z. Do 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 do. Y y y x y. Marsh do sail. So up up y down up y. Y while jumping. Y y while jumping. Okay. All right. Because. So eh. So that's a big stab. Ooh ooh. That is that is neat. That is kind of neat though. I do like that. Stop it. Stop it. Neat. If only I had like a gun. Wait, I do. Um, do I have regular non homing? No. I do have M um, grenade. Cuts out communications. This is an item? The direct land three minutes telling more than a girly magazine to get the attention of motion suppressed cyborgs. This should do the trick. What? They're 3D horny magazines? Uh, uh, all right. Wait. And fire. Didn't even alert that guy. The future. I've got a hologram of Hatsune Miku. The future is now. We got holographic super porn in the future. This is the future that Kojima's warning us about. This is the bad ending. Yeah. Eh, physics. Check the beginning of this. Thank you. You have to make progress and then double back. Oh, is that what the red dot is for? To be like, go back, there's a guy. What kind of guy? Hello. How you doing? It's two guys. It's just, it's just two. It's two. 
It's two of them. <laughs> Holy shit. This is fucked up. They're learning. They're adapting. They lost their trench coat. They did. Ow. Stop. He's got the move. I got it. This is getting out of hand. Thank you. I have no idea that I was there. Third guy that holds the hat. It's one of my favorite and least favorite parts of MGS4. Is when you can just catch glimpses of that guy following you. It's so fucking uncanny. Well, I turned back the mo- oh. Good timing on that message. I would have been cutscene locked. The boy in the sewers! Fucking game. <laughs> oh, okay. Hi. This one I got. Damn it. Where that fucking kid go? Go ninja, go ninja, go. Estás bien? What you say? Oh. Me a Guyanese from Guyana. You speak English? Uh, yeah. I'm from America. Call me Ryden. Me name George, like Georgetown. George. And just like all damn America president. Yeah. So what are you doing here? Like George me? Sears. What the rest of you do here? You lose the map of Ninja Hideout, Ninja Man? <laughs> no. I'm looking for bad guys. Ah, oh, damn Skunter Research Lab. You know about it? Me know me now go back. Hey, you know one of them Skunt, nah? Nah, I guess you're all right. If you're a cyborg, you know who Day is? Sort of. What happened to you? Oh, me been live on the street, rake and scraper above, nah? Then this good need dressed like the mafia say, Hey, boy, you want a job? What the worst gonna happen, nah? But that mother scone don't put me on a rass boat. They pack us all a pickable doji container. Next thing we know, we're here at the zombie lab. All kids like you? Yeah, a lot of boy. But then me been over here what them scone want to do. Snuff us out. And got all day organ. So you ran. Uh-huh. You shame me not a bad-ass robot ninja man, same as you! Ha! <laughs> me been strongest cyborg ever. Warlock all them phantoms and black clothes that I pass me. 
You're starting to sound like a bad guy yourself. Just playing, nah? Me done plenty bad thing, but me not kill no man. Nah, never. Good. We tried to warn the boy. I say, I would his brain would get cut out. Run your ass out of there. But them boy with me no understand. They like Spanish or something. So me the only one for escape. Then that machine come after me and... And I know the rest. George, I need every detail about how you escaped. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh. Buddy, Raiden, he was already cooperating and talking to you. <laughs> so the kid got into the sewers through a drainage channel? Yeah, he says the channel is super tight, but there's some kind of shutter next to it. Got it. That must be where they dump the waste. There's something else. It sounds like a Desperado exec was on site yesterday. If a sentry cyborg was on hand for the meeting... You should be able to review their video log, provided you can find a server access terminal. That would give us the evidence we need, as well as a little peek at the level of that technology. Doctor joined the Zoom so call. So what about the kid? I made sure the area was secure and told him to sit tight. Can you pick him up? Sure. I'll send a couple agents for him. You just focus on getting into that lab. If what he said is true about the organs, we need to hurry. Agreed. Riding out. If the organs are still fresh, we can profit off of them. What, Kev? Yeah. Oh-ho! Gotta love a sewer level. I remember this being one of the low points of this game. And not just because it's a sewer level, but mostly because it's a sewer level. Let's get fit with the Space Warlord Organ Training Simulator timeline. This is where the, the Warlord first got his organs. Heavy UG activity ahead. It is possible they are conducting test operations while the lab is closed. They're not going to make it easy to get into that lab. Is there some way you could sneak past? Like a stealth game? Low point in a mid 2010s video game. Color me shocked. Color are you shocked in a mid 2010s video game? You mean color are you beige? <gasps> it's it's a box. How's that gonna help? Oh, it's for medical supplies. That could work actually. A box. Put me in the box. Contaminated from transporting pharmaceuticals, the metallic foil lining is designed to maintain temperature inside the box, as the added benefit of shielding contents from infrared vision. Being a great place to hide from UGs and cyborgs. They had to explain. Oh! And it's gone. <laughs> well, that is a wobbly ass run, right? And he's not used to this box. <laughs> I'm in the box. I can't call while I'm inside the box. Quick comments if you actually stealth things. It's pretty good. Boris, we've got kids being held inside this lab. I'm no, I tried calling with there. it equipped. Copy that. Didn't let me. I will discuss with NGO what to do with them afterward. That's my boy. What are you thinking? Uh, well, this is difficult. I imagine these are homeless children, taken from streets. Likely they have no home to return to. But we cannot dump them back on streets. We could look for adoptions in the US, but some of these kids may be criminals. Could be drug addicts, HIV positive, not so easy to find homes. Yeah, wasn't easy for me either. The guys at the relief center were always worried I'd cause problems for my foster family. The alternative is putting them in an institution until they grow up, but this has issues as well. Most are already past capacity. Taking on this many street kids at one time would be impossible. Also, it's a matter of fairness. Is it fair to take in these kids here when millions more are dying? I imagine this is why rescue was not part of our contracted mission. The human rights NGOs, they know they can't rescue them all. They must take a wide view and confront the problem of traffickers, not their victims. Well, we can't just sit here and let them pull kids to pieces. Duh. On this, we agree. For now, rescue the children. We'll worry about the fallout later. Copy that. Just have them join the PMC, Jesus Christ. Miss Trowell mentioned someone from her past. More child souls. Any idea who that could have been? None. I checked her file again, couldn't find a thing. Definitely not Dolzaev. Probably not Sundowner either. 
No. The way she put it, it didn't sound like anyone I've encountered so far. Maybe someone involved in backing Desperado. If so, sounds like they're providing more than just financing. Maybe they share the same philosophy. That'd be bad. People willing to die for their leaders aren't so easy to predict. Yeah, but other than the winds, Desperado's cyborgs are all just hired contractors. They're probably emotion suppressed with nanos or drugs or whatever, but that's about it. Hmm. You're probably right. I, I, re I feel like this is the most Metal Gear DNA in this video game. Because if you just play the game and you stick to the, 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 the critical path, you slash dudes up and have the most amazing cutscenes you've ever experienced in your life. You stop and you talk to the guys and you're like, oh, 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 hmm, oh, oh, well, hmm. It's just like Metal Gear. I can't believe what they're doing in there. Guess I shouldn't be so surprised, huh? Guess not. Are you gonna help them? No other choice. I'll try to help look for some place that might take them in. Thanks. Least I can do. Did you want to save your data? No. Oh, yes, please. It feels more like parody. At times, yes, but then okay. some of these codec save calls complete. are just like, no. That's Don't just... let your guard down, okay? Like Metal Gear feels like a Metal Gear parody at times. Like it's just kind of. Very well done, you know? Raiden. Oh. Uh, Inverse of three. Thanks. Mm -hmm. I guess. That Raptor may have been smaller than an Irving, but its potential is simply remarkable. Defeating it is a fine demonstration of your body's abilities. I'm quite happy to see it working so well. Well, thanks, Doc. I'm quite happy I'm not dead, too. How did it feel to fight it? Well, an Irving has more strength and firepower. But this guy was a lot harder to keep a beat on. Not that big of a deal, but you definitely don't want to let your guard down around one. Indeed. A combination Irving and Tripod Force would be a formidable foe in any urban warfare scenario. The only problem is cost. A PMC would have to be well-funded indeed to even think about acquiring the necessary numbers to make it work. There are situations where an Irving may be overkill, but Tripods cannot provide the necessary force. So the Raptor was built to fill that gap? Indeed. Its basic design is a streamlined, more compact version of the Irving. Furthermore, it uses the same control system as the tripods, which helps keep costs low. It can use standard personnel weaponry as is, and its armor has been componentized. This is to say, the user can expand its defensive capability as needed. It's fit for standard military operations, anti-terror missions, even regular patrol and police duty. A most admirable check of all trades. <laughs> Adorable too, wouldn't you say? Uh, not the first word that comes to mind. Ah, yes. My apologies. I can't help but marvel at a well-made machine when I see one. There's no need to be jealous, though. Your body is still quite impressive as well. Yeah, uh, thanks, Doc. Every single conversation with Doc ends with Ryan being like, uh, uh yeah, okay, okay, yeah, okay, Doc. All right. Talk to you later. Faring? Hard to say just yet. Seems like he's doing okay. Good, good. I'm so pleased my repairs were effective. He seems happy enough, but I don't know. Can a machine really be happy? Maybe he's just being directed by his programming to behave that way. And what is wrong with that? If something you do for someone else is appreciated, it makes you happy. It's a perfectly normal reaction. One that applies whether you're man or machine, and whether or not you have intelligence. I guess so. When you watch a film, does it not make you happy when good things happen to the heroes in the end? I'm not seeing the connection. Well, those heroes are not really happy. They're just following a script written by someone else. The actors have human intelligence, but the characters themselves do not. It is a facade, an imitation, and yet we still feel an emotional connection. It does not matter that it is make-believe. <sighs> now, I certainly don't know whether the AI you encountered in the past was Neuro or not, but Wolf most certainly is. And with a neuro AI, it is not so simple as working off a set computer program. You can define intelligence however you like, but personally, I see no reason not to say Wolf has it. It possesses a neuro AI structurally similar to the human brain. It has learned enough of the world around it to be capable of human speech. Truly, an astounding artificial intelligence is at work here. One, I suspect, could make for substantial business opportunities, given the chance. Think of the possibilities, Raiden. What do you think a truly intelligent AI could do for it's the world? It's turning into a crypto I'll bro let you before know if I eyes. think of anything. 
riding out. <laughs> he he said the word facade, and this game is known for its watermelons, so the devs definitely played facade. It appears you have entered the sewer's maintenance corridor. It connects individual water conduits for inspection and work access. Additionally, it is used for material storage during expansion and construction work. How do you know all this? These are all logical assumptions. You're just guessing? All right, he really is chat GPT. Okay, anyway, enough of that. Let's fight some guys in the sewers. Yeah. Good thing I was stealthy getting in here. They don't even know I'm here. Sup? Hello. Uh, where am I? Where Where is this? Hello? Oh, that was... This is a good angle. Sup? Sup? Nope. Nope. Where's the other one? There he is! No, 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 no. Stop. God damn it, buddy. No, no, stop. God, I'm trying to dodge. Poke him, poke him. What? Anyway. We intercepted call for backup during your last fight. The caller's position is on your solid on radar. You can engage if you wish. It is your choice. Come fuck him up. You can lock him with R3. Thank you. Who we got? Calling for backup. I haven't spawned in yet. Done. You're under attack. What the fuck is that? It's like a water strider with a flamethrower. Hello. Can I parry fire? Now. Have it. Whoa. I was like, I'm still on alert for something. Hey, hey, hey. No, no. He's spent. Get off. It's a Pikmin boss. Mm -hmm. Hey, hey. Oh, no, you don't. More of them! Yeah. Now, 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 now. No, come on, get over there. Thank you, appreciate it. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Stop. Give me the goodies. Thank you. 
really like that cold ball. We're still good, Raiden. Very good. Yay! Yippee! Yippee! Yep. Yippee! Goodbye, spinny boys. Spin it, boys. Spin it, boys. Box. I would never forget. I mean, I did maybe. Right. I have determined the approximate location of the lab based on the boy's information. It is marked on your Soliton radar. Yeah. Right. Eh. Well. Shit. No, I'm a box. You can't spin towards me. I'm a box. See? That's what I said. I'm just a box. No, no, no. Damn it. My perfect run ruined. Ah, ah. I got an achievement that was like destroy five of those guys. I think it called them Vodom jerks. And I'm like, that can't be right. No way I read that right. Hi. Ow. You can't parry that. Shit. Where did he go? You can't carry fire. Then why is the flash red? Is your flash some kind of different color? Go they just keep spawning, don't they? Hi. Perfect stuff. Because fire hot. Thank you. Yeah, that's right. You don't know where I went. Oh, hold on. Was there... <laughs> hey, there was someone else hiding in here. Excuse, excuse me. Excuse me. This goddamn game. Thanks for the ray, Glitch Steven. Welcome. We're playing Metal Gear Rising Revengeance. And it's going great. How did you know? I'm a master. Don't know if it's worth looping around this place. To check for stuff. That's gotta be the only goodie here, right? Yeah, it doesn't look like there's anything else. Alright. What's up? Okay, where where to from here? Oh. Ho oh, ho. Oh. Neat. Big wall projection. Yeah. Pretty well hidden, yeah. I gotta say. I mean it showed up really bright on my radar. Nothing here. Don't. Yep. Okay. You must be me. Have the chat for box. Man. He was just doing his. He was living his best life, being a box man. So we got one over there, one over there, and he on this wall. Nope. A security camera. What could it mean? 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Inconspicuous. Second box. Let's go. So in case they destroy my first box, I got a spare. This is not the cereal you're looking for. I'm looking for my Raisin Nut brand. Have you seen it? Hmm. Welcome to Black Mesa. Oh, God. Oh, it's a conversation ah, hallway. This would appear to be the UG maintenance area. All right. You should find a terminal there. Something they use to upload mission parameters to the UG. Uh-huh, Doctor. And something I can use to access the lab's main server? Perhaps. Just look at writing cheeks. But first, you need to take a dump. I... Wait, what? A dump? A digital optical output mounted proxy. You'll need one to interface with the terminal. Most any UG should suffice. A tripod or the like. I'll see what I can come up with. How do I use it? Simply connect to it. You should be able to use your communications outlet to control the proxy UG. All right, let's give it a shot. My German doctor told me to take a doom. Who am I to deny him? Every day I'm dooping. Doom, 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 doom. Even the you're not in combat yet music is a fucking jam in this game. It's so good. Nano paste. Delicious. And whoop. Hello. Bullseye. He did. Right, right, right. I thought you said stealth ops were your special. Yeah. Oh, there's a guy alive in the thing. Let me see you shake that. Doom, 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 doom. Hello. E. Hi. Get the drop of those guys. Hey, come on. Get off. You have to go for it like right away. Okay. Yep, yippee. Uh, uh, uh. Guidance. If they continue to increase security, they may shut out all outside network connections. Okay. Please do your best to avoid being seen. Yeah, but it's fun to be seen. I like the combat better than I like the stealth. I'm also still not entirely clear on how I could have taken out all these dudes with stealth. You're pretty good. That must be Ames. How do, how do, how do I want, there's a, hmm. Well, I'm sure it's nothing. You have box, what more could you need? Oh, this cutscene. Forgot about this. <laughs> I love the eyeball room. Remember the eyeball room? Oh, hi. Now the door's open. It's mini Andros, yeah. yeah. Wait. Give me that, give me that, give me that. Grab it! Get off! 
Yeah, double spine. Twice as nice. Wait, 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 okay. No, I was about to... For now, yeah. But that room... Eh. Those were cyborg brain casings. Eh. Duh. We saw. I mean... George said they were harvesting organs from kids. Yes. This must be why they are trafficking children. Mm -hmm. Perhaps other organs are being sold elsewhere. But they are definitely taking their brains. Jesus. Are they making these kids into cyborgs? Wait. The cyborgs you've been fighting... Did they seem like they might be kids? You said earlier that child soldiers have a telltale approach to combat. Yeah, but I didn't see it here. Those weren't kids. So what? We're good. Desperado's just doing the surgeries there? Mm -hmm. We've got to do something about all those brains. And the other kids George was talking about. He just escaped a few hours ago. They couldn't have taken all their brains out that fast. True. There could still be a bunch of kids they haven't touched yet. I better move. Yep. Find the dwarf gecko. Yeah. Oh. Get go through the vent. Go through the vent, right? Can you not go through the vent? Did Kojima write this? Kojima, I believe, executive produced. Isn't that where I'm supposed to go? The kids are okay. Well, they're they're not okay, but it's not. Probably best you stay out of there. We don't want to risk harming any of the brains. Yeah, no. The the, the kids are all right. Oh, there's oh there's oh. It's all kind of Pikmin noises. I totally don't remember this. What the hell? <laughs> Splendid! It is all ours. Now, use it to locate a data input terminal. Holy shit, look at him go. You guys are pretty jumpy now. Any funny business, and they might just open fire. Try latching onto Cyborg's heads from behind. Then, an electric shock should knock them unconscious. Yeah. Permit to share my Spotify playlist? Uh, maybe. Why is this... Why is this a red dot on my... Radar? Oh, there's another guy. Hey, friend! Hee <laughs> hee! Hey, we're friends! Yeah! Maybe I can make him dizzy if I run around too much. Alright, catch you later. High five? High five. High five. High five. Stop. High five. I asked him for high five. No, I didn't. I didn't. He's resting. He high. He high fived so hard that he got sleepy. It's nap time. Did I little fucked up little Pikmin? Yeah. We always hurt the ones we love. Oh. Oh, my God. I didn't have to disrespect him on top of that, but I am slapping him on the nards. All right. See ya, buddy. It's not quite as good as in Peace Walker when you shock that guy on the beach in the tutorial. And he's like... Hey, 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 hey. It's pretty good. Hey. Hey, Paisano. High five? High five? High five? 
High five? Are you any better at high fiving than your brother? What? Oh, the slow light turning off. <laughs> Taint slap. Weep, 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 weep. Probably shouldn't shock in front of another guy. So. Ooh, roll attack. <laughs> Wait, what? You're rolling. It's really bad. Hold or tap, he just immediately fucking. Do I have to mash it? I don't. I have. How do you use this? He just immediately eats shit. All right. Well, it's pretty good. Oh, no, no. I didn't realize that starting stream with Katamari music was an apt choice, but here we are. This guy that's all hands can't high five. Did you see that? I hope you didn't see that. Don't look. Don't look. Don't look. He's not ball shaped with the arms. Yeah. I gotta lose some arms. <laughs> it's so sad. Um. I don't want you to see anything. Hey there. Whoa. Okay. That didn't even make it a lot. He just hates these guys. Thanks for the hydrate. Do that in a moment. Thanks for the reset. Thanks for the prime. Did you know that if you have Prime Gaming, you can be a little guy like this? That's actually one of the features of Amazon Prime. They don't really advertise it enough. IMO. High five? High five? High five? High five? <gasps> ah. I'm okay. Oh, I am going to die. <laughs> oh. I want to be a little guy. Can get find two more and put them in a trench coat. Ooh. Devs? Devs? Hey, Devs? Hey, Devs? I'm the worst. This is horrible. Damn it. Get him. Uh, <laughs> I don't deserve good things. Kitten Slayer. Uh, there's a guy in a box over there. Sup? Yet I keep doing it. Yeah, because, you know, I'm a bad person. Whoa, shit. Well, that took him out. Boy, I am going to explode imminently. Um, what's my objective again? Over here somewhere? Side room? Oh, it's up the upstairs. Eh. It's not a invisible. Okay. So I gotta... We gotta... Parkour? Can I? Oh. 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 Data storage. Four out of 20. Let's go. Funny number. Let's the meme number in the meme game. Let's go. All right. What am I doing in here? All oh, getting into a little. Oh. A D. <laughs> yeah. That was pretty slow. Um, that terminal is most likely designed to download mission data and such into the UGs. Let's try using it to access the lab server. Come on, come on, bud. Oh. God damn it. See, if, if this was a more Titans, recent game... I found something. He would in been... one of the Sentry Cyborg's Hold visual on. logs. Guess who shows up? Hold that thought. Patch it through. Right away. Thank 
Thank you for understanding. Say what you have. Not now I'll destroy any unharvested inventory. Yeah? But have you any idea what they cost? Last night, That's right. children weren't exactly rare in the part of the world. Millions of them, in fact. You can get more once we set up a new lab. They lead lives of hunger and pain. We're performing a service here for them and the cities they burden. But just gathering the donors required a significant investment. Yes, yes. yes you'll get the money. Accounting will be in touch. Gracias. I assure you we will dispose of our inventory the instant we can confirm payment. Are we done here? I've got a full slate today. Takumse is a demanding mistress. And America has suffered long enough. Oh, yes, sir. Thank you, sir. Let me see you out. You see that, Kev? Imani's killer. Desperado's chief of operations goes by Sundowner, the Californian wildfire. The kids. Think we're too late? Only one way to find out. George was still alive. Maybe the payment hasn't come through yet. Hmm, maybe. But you heard what he said. They've already started some brains on VR training. There must be more than just what I found here. What about the VIP in the suit? I'll find out. He definitely seemed familiar. Right. I'm going after the kids. Alert! So, what I was gonna say was, um... I guess if they made a sequel to this game and you had a bit where you were stealthing with a little... little three-armed lad, he would go to put in the, uh, the USB and it would just go in first try and then Alakon would hop on the, the codec and be like, Wow! USB-C! You don't have to put it... Uh, both sides are, are correct. You don't have to put it in only on one side. It's the future, Snake. That's all I was gonna say. USB seed these nuts. Exactly. Anyway, they come back for a vengeance. Get up. Get off. Feel your rage. Oh, I feel it. I feel it in this game being 11 years old. I feel it all of the time. No, they're fine. They're robots. Wait. I want to get the left arm. Eh. Did, I, did, I, did I get? Did I get? Did I get him? Did I get him? Am I getting him? Get Alright. You win this time. I want the arm. I think I got him. Might have. Might have. Destroyed. Great. Got their Gatorade spines. Yeah, I like their Gatorade spines. How I stay hydrated. Who do do do? Endurance plus up one, one plus go up. Number happy me. Hello. Attention. Next hydrate. I veer. I veer. It has the same energy as dental plan. I don't not hear it, but I, I, I can't describe where that's coming from. Oh, another Gosh, hallway. Right. We can't find George. What? Maybe the coordinates you sent us were off? No way. I merged the GPS location of our entry with all my movement data from that point on. This is bad. You think they got to him first? I don't know. I'll have our guys sweep the area. Thanks. I better keep moving. Fui. 
He was too curious. No. I'm sure I'm not going to find anything in here. Yep. Coast is clear. It's just firing at an empty wall. Hey. Just run at it. This bastard is blocking the way. Push that thing back. Okay. Yep. What if what if uh what if I uh what if I um red phosphorus uh, make an effect kind of regimen is usually used to cyber with IR based cameras. Okay, jam remote controlled UGs. Does that count as that? Electro magnetic surgery with the uh, Done. Ow. Get jam! It didn't do anything! <laughs> Metal gear? Oh, man! They switched to biped mode. Careful. They call you battle now. I'm going to die. Doctor. I'm going to perish, Doctor. Any, any stuff? Will this keep me alive? No. Will this keep me alive? No. Paste equipped and items. It has switched to biped mode. Careful. Yeah. It is all new battle now. Hi. Right. I'm trying to. There. Oh, yeah. That would probably help, huh? Uh, so, what's. Electrolyte fuel cell. Okay. Yeah. I want that on. Good. All right. We're back. That would help. Oh, 
Stop. Why are you skiing? I'd seen that guy before. What? Stephen Armstrong. Nice. As in Colorado Senator Stephen Armstrong. Colorado? They're already talking about him as a shoe in for the nomination in 2020. Nomination? And get this. Two years ago, a federal grand jury investigated his ties to a certain private. World Marshal. One of the biggest PMCs out there. The distant future. I remember. Channel. The biggest ever since the Big Five split up. Not to mention the single largest investor in military cyborg R&D in the world. Guess that answers the question of who's backing Desperado. Marshall and Desperado in bed together. Should make for some fun headlines. Headlines? This is World Marshal and a U.S. Senator we're talking about. There won't be any headlines. Even without the Patriots filter, no major media outlet will investigate allegations like these. It'd be financial and political suicide. So we just what? Sit back while they keep carving up kids, stand aside while they build an army of cyborgs. You heard them. We shut down one lab, they build another. They're planning something big, Kev. We can't just wait for it to happen. We need to hit them first and hit them hard where it counts. No, Raiden, no. I know what you're thinking and just no. Colorado is in America, and America has these things called laws. Mm-hmm. And law enforcement in Denver was privatized and farmed out to... Marshall, yes, so what? There are still laws, and it's their headquarters for Christ's sakes. You'd be heading right into the heart of a raging shitstorm. I didn't say it would be easy. We'll figure it out once the kids are safe. Jesus Christ! Kevin, out! Yippee! Pretty sure there are laws where you are too most of the time. Yeah, listen. Unless we're in America, there aren't any laws to what we're doing. Yahoo! Let's call in Phoenix Wright from MVC3 specifically. Oh shit. That was okay. Hi. Give me, give me your arm. No, I fucked it up. I'll take that though. Here we go again. I just wanted to see what was over here. You gave me a hallway with some stuff in the way. It was gonna be a goodie at the end. Yeah. Oh boy, an M grenade. The M stands for M. Good thing it's still like fictional country of America that Ryan has to go against. Yeah. Unlike the currently fictional country of Mexico that we're currently in. Oh. Ah, an artificial blood cryopreserver. They must have begun preparatory freezing. What do you mean? That device is filled with synthetic blood plasma. It can slow the metabolism of a harvested organ, circulating this plasma to sustain oxygen levels. You can preserve an arm, a brain, any body part for several hours. So what are they freezing, and why? I could not say. Perhaps they plan to sell off the organs of the children they were told to dispose of. Unbelievable. You had best hurry, right? Right. Mexico, isn't that just the nonsense word Mario says at the start of a level? No, you're thinking of Juice Pickle. Unlocked VR mission seven. Seven. Donald the Goofy are in there and swords in the bigger pot in this. <laughs> what? Shit. Stop right there! Huh. 
George. Right in. You've heard of chloroform? A potent anesthetic in smaller doses. But breathe too much of it? And adios, muchachos. Break that glass, and I'll blow his brains out. Surrender, or decide the needs of the many or the needs of the few. Right in. Don't worry about me now. Quiet, pendejo. <laughs> Surrender. I won't ask again. George, are you sure? Hmm? Hmm. I'm ready. Me life now so precious. Ching, what if me can take this scunt to hell with me? Cállate! Stop posing, save the children. <laughs> we did, all right, what about the children? Don't worry about them. We traumatized one child, what about the rest? I got bad. Yippee. Yippee. There it is. <laughs> That's your consolation prize for a very fucked up cutscene. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> have a sombrero. <laughs> Customize his body. Why, why, why wouldn't I? Oh my god, it's so expensive, but so worth. Traditional garb for Mexican folk musicians purchased by Raiden at a souvenir shop south of the border in a misguided attempt to blend in with the locals. It's a quit. Are you happy, chat? I do like the MGS4 Ryan suit. I like that that's an option. Bueno. <laughs> Muy bueno. Uh, enhancements. Oh, yeah. Oh, they're pricey. Okay, I can do better with all those. What else we got? Unique weapon. Can upgrade the pole arm. Okay. Noted. Life! More life, more better. Yep. Gonna grab that without a second look. Fuel cells, no. Not yet. And then skills. There's some other skills in here I haven't grabbed yet. Yep. Um, I'm gonna make my blade better because that's just all around a good time. Strength! And absorption and energy. Yeah. Buying fuel cells so good. Yep. But I don't have more to buy yet. Boop, 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 boop. Cannot afford any of these. Can I afford any of these? No. All right. Which game out a sequel? Mm hmm. I don't have more because I didn't buy the first. Did I not buy the... Did I not... I didn't. Hey, thanks. Appreciate it. All right, well, that's better. Okay. Need more bup. I gotta get more bup. I'm not nearly enough bupping. Despite what his appearance made. I hate this outfit so much. Okay. Great. I'm glad we're gonna look really good in the gameplay room. Denver, shout out to Colorado. Home of the, 
home of the mariachi. Police are still investigating a motive. President Hamilton is on his way to the Middle East this morning for Hamilton. a scheduled visit with Pakistani President Farooq Salam. The meeting is viewed as an attempt by the U.S. to strengthen relations amidst a surge of anti-American sentiment in the region. Colorado mentioned. Yo, me ninja brother. George, good to see you up and about. How you feeling? Never better, na? No pain, no more for star while them hunger space eat, and me never ever feel so awake, nah! That's because your blood sugar levels are being maintained automatically. Beats the hell out of coffee. Oh! Me been here you go while I got them scorn in the base. Why the rat are you not take me with you, huh? Damn it, Doc. Sorry, kid. You'd just be in the way. Aww. Besides, I thought you didn't want to be a killer, right? Me don't, but... Killing isn't fun in games. Remember that. Right. He got his arm cut off. Yep. Yep. <laughs> That's all I needed to hear. No! It yearns to bathe in the blood of her enemies, but you hold it back. Is this whole bottom half gone actually? Yeah. Even worse. Just remember that. They shot at him and then said pull over. Private, what is this? Kamia? You cannot resign! Sorry, Boris, it's done. Can't have a Maverick employee involved in a corporate raiding now, can we? You could at least come talk to me. No. It was time to break away from the old team, Boris. Past time. You cannot take on Marshall all by yourself. I won't sit by while they butcher little kids and ship their hearts around like meat. It's sick. It's not all so simple, right? They import those brains legally. For medical purposes, it's all done. Being legal doesn't make it right. Right, I... Hold that thought. <laughs> Welcome to America. Give me a boost, assholes. Still got them heels, baby. Cyborg, you are not licensed to operate in this area. Uh -huh. You're in violation of state and federal law. Yeah. Guess you'd better arrest me then. <laughs> 18 3 104.7 threatening a peace officer. Deadly force is authorized. Okay. He just said, come arrest me. It was... All right, now that's a threat. That's okay. All right. It was pretty funny. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, da, 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 da. Get off. Yeah. More Patriot intel. Bring me more. And maybe I can develop something interesting coming. Woohoo. Yahoo. <laughs> Wait. Why is there a hat? Because I bought the hat. They switched from guns to clubs. The guns were non deadly. Oh, wait, can I do a side attack into like a. Oh, yeah. 
I forgot about that. You can Zandatsu while you're sliding underneath them. And it's so fucking satisfying. It's so silly. Back. Oh, where am I? Where am I? Forget the wall. Hi, right, give me that. Get juggled. Feet attacks? Uh, there's been a few. Like that. They just kind of pop up in combos sometimes. So I think the pull arm replaces some of them. Back. Hi. Remember, they're cyborgs. They're fine. They're fine. Fine. Sometimes. Yeah, 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 Fine. Now buff right out. Oh, is is physicsing along. It's wild this game functions at all. <laughs> like, come on. The fact that this game doesn't just instantly explode into a million pieces every time you cut anything is a small miracle. Right. Oh, hi. <laughs> Wait, 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 wait. Oh, time out. The power of the PS3. This game ran on the PS3. It's nuts. Hello? It ran on the PS3. Poorly. Yeah, maybe. I don't remember having that much of a bad time with it. I mean, I did figure playing it on the PC would probably be a better time than PS3. The road is blocked by barricades. We will proceed through the buildings. You will follow me. Wall near start for some Kojima Y. Oh, that is that? Yeah, okay, Kojima Y. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, right. Yeah, okay. Yeah, all right. The PC portals increase how many parts and how long they stay on screen. Death more on the PS3. That's fair. They might have let, let the upper limit increase a bit. Got to send out to the tape. Nope. You can blade mode the tape. Is this going to nuke the VOD? Chat? Chat? No? Or oh no? Bye, Vod. Yes, Tobarich. We're fine. Everything's fine. <laughs> Jesus Christ. And Boris is like, you quit? How dare you? Ooh, very good, right? <laughs> Th thanks? Thanks? Thank oh! More of these! Ah. Ah. I love them wearing the mariachi suit. No, 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 no. Jesus. Um, can I just, eh? Can I do that? Yeah. Got him. Oh, hello. May I? Judge.
Wait, I want to do the flip. Let me do the flip. Yeah! I love that! Pull ball! Spin! Raiden is a big three. Damn it. Yippee! I've never been to Denver. Is this what Denver looks like? PT reference! HQ, requesting this zone be designated for heightened security. Roger. Upgrading security status. Yeah, kind of actually. Neat. Do not go in the bank. All right. So... A little den Denver, Denver. Nice part. Doesn't allow cars, but what's yes? Did it allow cars in 2010 or 2013? This area, not so much. Are there a sword wielding mariachi in downtown Denver? Anyone from Denver in the future? Confirm what as well looks like. The enemy? Hello. <laughs> Yoink! The distant cyberpunk future of 2018. Oh god. <laughs> Got your hand. We intercepted call for backup during your last fight. The caller's position is on your solid on radar. You can engage if you wish. It is your choice. The call is coming from inside the solid on radar. Are the cops also cyborgs? Everyone's a cyborg. Your route through Denver has been plotted based on data culled from various security systems. Thank you, Doctor. I took the liberty of adding a guidance device to your chassis to ensure you do not stray too far. Handy, eh? You added a GPS to my point loins, Doctor? Is that legal? Here comes more of them. <laughs> okay. Okay. All right. Yeah, okay. Hey, hey, quit it. No. Yeah, no, that's not. Can't even tell what's happening sometimes. Which is a good thing. Your boy lines are company property, right? I quit the car. My boy lines are my own, dog. Shit. You missed! Good, 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 good. Meow. Let me let me fix that. Yeah. It was full of dirt. By God, it was made of dirt. Doctor, it had dirt in it. Doctor, am I made of dirt? Ryden, you're having an existential crisis. What am I? What if I'm dirt? What if I'm just dirt all the way down, Doctor? Did you turn me into a cyborg made out of dirt? Is this who I am? I can't go back to Rose if I'm made out of Dort. Right, calm down. How can we sound like that now, Doctor? I don't know. Yahoo! Now I'm over. Ooh. Goodies. Koji, that's enough, Dort. You can't stop me from eating all the Dort. Can I... Is that the entrance I'm supposed to go into? 
How am I supposed to hit? Oh. Now look at that. Oh, yeah, I made it. Made it to the big building. Brighton, what's your status? They trashed my car. I'll have to go the rest of the way on foot. Do you really have to do this? Look, I'm fed up with all of it. Companies like ours, yours, bend the laws when it suits business. Why not bend it when it can save innocent lives? Raiden. Boris, listen to me. That VR training, they'll be warped into killing machines. They'll be set on POWs, civilians. It'll be one atrocity after another. Hmm. Like what you went through. We can't have any more Jack the Rippers. You saw what happened with George. I'm doing this, Boris. I have to. I can't save those kids from becoming cyborgs, but I can stop them from becoming murderers. Say so you succeed. Say so you get all the brains back. Then what? Just so happens I know un great cybernetic surgeon. Doctor, but he cannot... You won't change my mind, Boris. This is my fight now. And your wife and son? What of them? They're in New Zealand. Safe. Rose would understand why I have to do this. <sighs> All right, damn you. You do realize Marshall has the contract for law enforcement throughout the city. They are the law in Denver. Yeah, we've met. Well then. <clears throat> Officially, Maverick Incorporated condemns you and your actions as unlawful. And a pain in the asshole. Now, increase your codec encryption. Do not worry about the lag. And unofficially? I'll do all I can over the codec to help. I do not like what those mudaki are doing any more than you. Spasiba, Tavarich. Spasiba. Mm hmm. Eh. I don't remember what this does. Just remember that there's a thing you can do. Yes, Tavarich. Oh. Huh. Okay. Yeah, right. Scandalous! This game is very good, except for the times where, where you... When... Denver Newspaper Building! They got newspapers in 2018? What? Information Meetings, International Economic, Social, Political Culture, Athletics, Photography, Science. Every section of newspaper has its own goddamn floor? Damn. Yeah. <laughs> That'll teach economic section. Denver Post, this downtown looks nothing like this. Well, it might get sued if it was too close. Hmm. I found some skittles on the ground. There was stuff in the vending machine! Nice. That's neat. I have an appointment. With your death. Oh, hi. Yep. Stop. No, no, no. From zero to a hundred. No, no. Can't get me from ninja running. I got a new box. Thank you, Chad. Nope. I've been to downtown Denver and it's not entirely inside a building. Have you been since 2018?
find an elevator inside that office. Use it to reach the roof. Traveling atop buildings will minimize enemy encounters. I mean, it was years after this, but I realized what the, like, post-mission noises and UI and stuff reminds me of. Reminds me of Astral Ch which I believe was also platinum, so it's not really surprising, but Astral Chain was a fucking great game. I feel like a lot of people slept on Astral Chain. It's on the Switch. It sure was. I mean, I don't know I'm surprised I made it out with that layout. <laughs> surprised I made it out. I had to travel through several buildings. Ho ho. This is so fucking stupid. <laughs> it's just... Thanks for the hydrate. Astro Chain's great. It's neat. There's a blade mode in that game too, but it's repulsive. Mm -hmm. Underappreciated gem. A gem, I tell you. Just gotta slice it along the tape. You know, there's a rumor the MIBs come from Area 51. MIBs? They're called the MIBs? Here come the men in boxes. It's a good thing they can't see. Oh. Ah! I was gonna say, good thing they can't see me through glass, but they actually could. Hold on. Hold on. Time out. Time out. Whoa, what's that? A grenade. That dude had a fancy arm. Hold on. Wait. Did I get it? I don't think I got it. Wait. Nope. I hate when they take out the fucking rocket launcher. I know. It seems like overkill. But, you know. They're tr trying to justify their budget. The $50 trillion every quarter. I knew before Barry's video. That Disney's answered backwards. Mm -hmm. I like how many people I introduced to that idea, though, from the video. I mean, that's why it was like one of my favorite bits from the seven hour stream. That I put into the video. Blender. We, we did set the blender mode. Can't remember. Mm. Bingus box. Like, there were a couple jokes from the 7 hour stream where I was like, I gotta put that into the final video. And that was one. Just flipping Disney's Doc, picture backwards. What's your saying, yes. I am reviewing the pre flight checklist now. I have hired contractors you, to handle shipping the brain units. We should be airborne in just a few minutes. You sure you can pilot that chopper by yourself? Right, and of course. Need I remind you that we live in the golden age of unmanned flight? Even manned helicopters possess a robust semi-automatic mode. It is simple, really. So simple that I can continue to monitor your status and world marshal security from the pilot seat. I must say, for the world's largest PMC, their security procedures are quite poor. Quite poor. Sadly, I did not have the necessary permissions to override their plans. Nevertheless, the data I did find should prove most useful. So please, do feel free to contact me whenever you like. Appreciate it. Barak. Well, it's not every day one has the chance to collect so many brains. Think of the data. The research. Oh, and of course, your personal safety was a concern as well. Thanks, Doctor. Squinting was going to time. I mean, it's how I feel. I mean, if I didn't have a webcam on for this stream, would you really get the same impression of how I'm feeling about it as we're going through? I can only sigh and scream with hype into the into the microphone so much. Barrel. Touch it. Barrel. Drum cam. Drum. A metal barrel used to store oil and other liquids. Its contents are shielded from infrared vision. <laughs> I forgot that the mariachi. Had 
<laughs> Wait, does that work with the like, box too? Oh, this game is so good. This game is so very good. Oh my god. Uh, what's this Mexican barrel doing here? Nothing. Muffled the cucaracha noises. <laughs> Uh, yeah, uh, yeah. All right. Okay. All right. Where am I? What am I? How are we? There's a thing. Okay. All right. I'm okay. They got some bump. This is art. Belongs in a museum. Eh. Am I supposed to go up here? HQ. We could use some support. Oh. Okay. All right. This just feels like Spider-Man 2 now. With the little fly guys going around. Thanks, Taco. I appreciate all the part anniversary messages. I know Twitch is like, here's a button to press. But still, I appreciate you posting it and sharing. This is Detroit become Raiden. Can I get him from here? Yeah. <sighs> Get, get it, get, get. Good time it gets this is Zoro. Sure is. He didn't see that. I am stealth. Get up, get up there. Can I, eh. Uh. I have legit no idea how you actually stealth your way through these encounters. Sword's gonna fight them. But I can start with a, um, with a rocket launcher. Try to go in the flying dudes. Got him. Now, they're not gonna expect a barrel to have done that. No way a barrel did that. No, it's a barrel. No! Broken. How dare you? It's personal now. Stop it. Stop it. Assaulting a barrel, leave the forces authorized. Dumb. Uh, hey. Hey, thank you. Barrels don't kill people. Mariachi kill people. That sounds like a line from Desperado or something. I need to rewatch Desperado. My whole trilogy of Robert Rodriguez films. Well, wasn't there another thing? Oh, it's over there. Uh, Yahoo! No! How long is this game? I feel like you're fairly, 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 fairly far along. Um, yeah, so someone earlier said that the online estimate is about seven hours for a casual playthrough. So even including Pooh Brain and doing codec calls, we're, we're decently far along. We're probably like roughly halfway through, I guess. Yeah, it's not it's not a very long game. It is it is designed to be a bit replayable. Where like you can replay the missions and go for S rank and stuff. And there's unlockables tie that stuff. We're gonna do the DLC. Yeah, that's the thing, guys. I didn't know there was DLC. So maybe? Probably depends on how things go. Ooh. There's something shiny. Oh, there's like a rocket launcher. Speed running by mashing. That's the way. A splice run? Ho oh, oh. Can't block that. Okay. Oh. Wait. Ow. Ah. He 
cheated the revenge speedrun. Yep. No. Nah. Oh boy. He tracks you. Two of them? I haven't learned how to fight one of them. Boy. Ah. Oh boy. I have my things equipped, right? Sure do. Fuck. No. I'm fine. Yeah. I'm fine. That'll do him. How is he still deflecting the other guy? He's a he went, it's just a flesh wound. And he's still running at me. But learn the call please! Holy shit. No. Bathroom explodes for the guys for four hours. I love bathroom explode. Am I biased? Yeah. Am I biased in this instance? No. I don't know what that means. Oh. All right. Two can play the slowly walking around game. Yeah, look at me. I'm a sea cyborg. I like walking around slow and looking around for enemies that I never see until it's too late. Nice patrol we're having here, aren't it? You guys hear mariachi music? Oh no! Oh no! Whoa! You get a little He's fine. Ah! Did it just destroy that sir? Ralphie at Launcher. The unmanned helicopter, it's fine. There's a guy that oh there is a guy down there. Someday I'll chop the left it's the left rotor. That's why the game follows your slashes. That's like the point of the game. Is good. Yeah. How long is the DLC? Because yeah, I don't know if I've ever Whoop. See ya. Um yeah, uh uh box. Combined like four hours. Com there's more than one DLC? Like an hour or two each. Gotcha. Okay. Huh. Are they good? You can tackle them both in the stream. The hat. It's so good. Hello? I'm trying to get the arm. Did I get it? Did I get it? I don't know if I reached it. There. I saw a dog one single tech. Technic technically fun. Oh, they have a hostage. Oh. Uh. Uh. There's another. Oh. 
Oh, this isn't going to go well. Why is there a hostage? You know. Hashtag just Denver things. What do they do? Some things world marshal. No, don't. No, don't. Get away from them. No. That damn it. I was trying to go away from them. Son of a... This game sucks. Hey, a rocket launcher. I've never found a way to save them even with smoke bombs. It just... Even getting the jump on them and taking them out, it seems like they just get away. I mean, that was my bad. I think it was my slash that took them out, but... Even still, it's it's not like in a lot of stealth games where it's like, oh, there's a sensitive area, but you can lure people away from that point and kind of drag them out and take them out one by one. This is just like, you initiate combat at some point and then hope they don't die and reset if they do. It seems like a weak point of the game. Any further via the rooftops. There could be a part there of it. There is a freight but... railroad underground. Now what? The elevator ahead will take you to it. Frag grenades don't kill them? What? That seems extremely unintuitive. Well. Eh. Yahoo. Yahoo. I wonder if I need to, uh... Yeah. Did I do that? This must be the railroad. It would appear so. Likely part of Denver's old system. This city was a major transport hub in the early years of freight trains. This particular line appears to have been abandoned some time ago. It was originally constructed to transport supplies to an underground factory. But now, it seems even the electrical system is no longer functioning. Yeah, it's pitch black in here. As a cyborg, I trust this is not a serious concern. As long as I don't have to fight anything. What if I do enough attacks that things grow red hot? Maybe not. This music kind of reminds me of Metroid Prime a little bit. In a very good way. Wolf is intuiting all this. He loves to intuit things. Phase on my it's big phase on mine's energy. Oh. Um. Oh boy. Just what I needed. So I am gonna have to fight these guys in the dark. I don't remember this level either. It's definitely been long enough. Do not expose yourself! What? Okay, alright. That's what the... Oh. Well, that's very spooky. I wonder if speedrunners just sprint through here in the dark and have it memorized. That's just neat. So that guy is right there, right? He's not behind anything. Boy, this sucks. Got it memorized. Always. It better not have a hostage down here. Looks like his back is to us on the left. Committed to memory. Does he keep walking or does he turn around? Buddy? Damn it. Okay, he does. That's pretty much it. There's an achievement for it. <laughs> Sprinting through without turning on your AR vision. That's great. You can only stealth kill these guys. Can you? Oh, that seems like a terribly risky idea to try to jump around in the dark to gain, because you need to be above them in order to do a stealth kill. If memory serve. You can backstab? You can? Won't they hear me approaching? There's, it's like right fucking there. Oh, Dark Souls up in here. More like Dark Soul. 
Use the box. Use the box. It's really hard to tell what he's doing, though. How do you back? Oh. Did he see that? He didn't. Nope. Nope. He didn't didn't see nothing. I'm a ghost. You'll never see it coming. Quiet. I'm very quiet. It's right, little car. You're something? Nope. Walk away so I can sneak up behind you. The camera really wants to shift behind me. Are you gonna... But, buddy, are you... But... He seems to be... Saying bullseye is a frequency cyborgs can't hear. Yes. All right, well, never mind. Except I don't think I can... Okay, apparently I can. Now he what? Now he what? Is he still following me, sir? What in tarnation? Okay. Go away. I'm just a little sewer rat mariachi. I am of no concern to you. Boxes do what work on them as the tool of dimensions. So if I'm just like hanging out here. He's not even moving though. It's like his AI broke. Tool tip. Toop toop tip. Isn't he just gonna see me and be like, that's a box opening fire? Barrel probably not boxes. Good thing my barrel got destroyed. Wait, it worked? Well, the boxes also have a lining on them. I really hate the camera fighting me. Is he just, he's just standing. I feel like his AI broke because it's like he moves to my latest position in caution mode. I mean, I could just fight him. Let's fight him. Hello. <laughs> Look, it's brighter if you fight him. <laughs> this secretly was lighted. Oh my god, camera. Yeah. What? 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 What was that? Hi. Yeah, I, down I downloaded the fight light. And then it gets dark again. <laughs> I mean, I appreciate it from a gameplay perspective. It's a bit goofy, though. The camera's the trend, me. As is true of any video game, literally ever. Data storage. I want that. That's a thing I want. What the? What? Why are you up there? How do I backstab you if you're up there, Mr. Man? Get down here. Thank you. Whoop. Oh, this is quite not. Why are there so many red dots over here? What the fu- Tiny lads. Got it. Well, this sucks. I have to wait for him to drop down and then try to run up behind him and backstab before he jumps back up on the wall? How am I supposed to do that? I guess I could go over to where the homing missile is and then wait. That's gonna have to be the strat. So now he's... Okay, my camera really didn't like what he did. 
I'm looking over. He's up there. What the hell, camera? Okay. He, he should be. Holy shit, this camera is fighting me. I hit the button. Oh my god. I hit the fucking button. Whatever, man. Whatever. These guys aren't even that bad. It's just like if you're gonna give me a stealth segment and then fail me on a technicality. No! Yippee. All right, back for the storage. Okay, I can't put my AR back on while that is, okay. Thank you. Hmm. Is there a way to grab this without getting pounced on by little guys? Did I do? Or am I required to pass through the little guy corridor? Seems I might have. Although I don't see it. I guess I just have to parkour on top. And get got by little guys. Now you, you, hey. No, my repair unit. Thank you, Fight Light. Locking all the camera helps in combat. You know, so I need to look up what it is because I tried clicking the right stick and that's just reset the camera. Switch lock on his right bumper. I have no idea what the actual lock on is. It's right bumper for some reason. Okay. It says switch lock on. Maybe that also activates lock on. I'll have to try it. We would have to experiment more. More guys. Good. Whoop. I kind of blocked out all the parts of this game that aren't 11 out of 11. There is a maintenance shaft up ahead. Use it's still a good game, but the it's definitely a lot in this game I forgot about. Hello. Hello. Also, it's like your normal walk is really slow, and then faster than it seems like it alerts enemies, so I don't really know. It's also possible I just got supremely unlucky and he didn't hear me. He just turned right at that time. The stuff, the real good, the good stuff is real good, and the rest is mm, yeah. A little bit. More little guys up there, looks like. Anything? Else? Oh, really? We got another fighting lad. Hey, are we friends? Are we cool? Ow! Hey! Okay, yeah, right bumper is a lot. Hey, hello? It asked me to the sound doctor, but then... Alright. Let's just smile and nod. Back-to-back -back bosses, barely any normal enemy counters in between. Mm. Nice! New drum can. Let's go. Just a box. Nope. So there's guys up above. Yep. There sure are guys up above. Whoop. Nope. Hey. I love that zanky flying kick he does. 
Where's the thing? Shit. Damn it. But a Mel, you're fighting him, meaning that dude. The, the two dudes on top of each other in a stack. It's a pretty good dude. paste in my pocket and I know just where to socket it I wish there was an option to like be able to use oh well it's like here to like Bryce, have right and it would appear exude. your only way forward is to return Light. to the surface you will exit into an evacuated commercial district but it consumes Security power is heavy but you need not worry about collateral damage when engaging the oh, that's enemy. good. About time. Finally, I can cut loose. Proceed to the right from the exit. You will find a stairway on your right. Those stairs lead to a shortcut to World Marshal Headquarters. Do not be distracted by the advertisements. You are not here as a tourist. Sure. I'll just buy a quick souvenir or two for Rose and that'll be it. Raiden, we must hurry. Remind me to teach you about sarcasm sometime. I understand your attempts at humor. I simply do not find them entertaining. Holy shit, dude. Ow. Damn. Fuck. I thought we were good friends, man. Ow. God damn, dude. Oh boy. The armor shits. I get it. Didn't make me laugh, but I get it. Mm -hmm. I understand. Ooh, a boy, advertising. You have almost reached World Marshal Headquarters. Huh. I do like how he says, don't worry about collateral damage now. Implying I was worried about it. Well, I guess there were hostages. So. Ah, the missile is chasing me! <laughs> yeah, give me your arm. Ow. No, wait. Damn it! God damn it, I was too far from him. Appears there are enemies on the overpass. I suggest cutting the road supports. That like an angry down. beat. Mm -hmm. How do I? How do I get up? How do I get up? No! 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 Oh! 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 You want? Oh, I bet. I, you know, I bet I could. I bet I could bring him down to me. I bet I could bring him down to me. Yeah, that works. He suggested that I wasn't listening to him. He said my jokes weren't funny. Hit him with the Star Wars prequel move. Thanks for clipping that and calling it Yakety Sacks. Appreciate it, Ryan. Hmm. So that guy's got a fancy arm up on top. I wonder if I could. Through the power of stuff. Doesn't know there's a mariachi box behind him. And inside the mariachi box, a mariachi. Yeah! Get off! Got him! I don't think I got the arm. 
fuck. I thought I sliced. Adios, muchachos. People will think I've modded the game. They would be mistaken. Mariachi in the box. Uh, yeah. Get off. He David knows. Yes, Tovarich. He's not paid enough to notice. Uh, Roy. Ooh. Delicious. Scrumptious. Get a taste of Denver. Hmm. Denver Mall. Oh, yeah. Hello. Oh, ooh. Taste the Denver Food and Wine Festival. Bariachi, Bear the Sombrero. I do love me some cultural appropriation in my emotes. Um, we're probably cool to just run in here and fight them. Sup? Sir? <laughs> Sorry, it's just not every day you hear an NPC go, Ah, oh, fuck me. Uh, where'd he go? Hi. Yep. Hi. How you doing? Get off. Get all the spines. Chain them together. Get off. Oh. This goddamn game. The stock LQ84 Fenrir. Unable to speak. A real dog has a far greater intellect. Nope. Hey. Okay. That one you can add to the counter chat. I will concede that, I suppose. Send your taste buds a mile high. Taste the Denver. Not anymore, you're not. I suppose. I suppose. Yeah, but sad. Something, something, I suppose. so-called free thinkers when they hear something something I suppose I suppose yeah I remember what's coming but not enough to remember if I should be excited Isn't this all a bit much? I should remember Any would have quit after Mexico. some of this jet stream Sam I heard you the last in half. and a kid yeah can't break that is excessive sir gonna fix everything just you and your new sword there solve everything with violence is that it Ah, if it isn't a is that a sombrero? My sword is a means to an end. To protect those you'd prey on. Really? Let me ask you. All those cyborgs you've killed up to now, maybe they weren't kids, but they were people. You ever think about them? They were people? When you're chopping them into hamburger? <laughs> they're adults. They made their choice. Sure they're adults. Sure they signed up for this. Right on the dotted line of their BMC contract. Usually they're no strangers to war. In fact, many times they already lost a limb or two. Many times they were out of work and starving on the street. So yes, 
They signed up for surgery to fight God knows where. How else would you provide for your family when your country's embroiled in civil war? Pain receptors shut down, pumped full of fear inhibiting nanomachines and sent right into the blender? Your blender? But they made their choice, right? Open your eye and see, Raiden. I've seen plenty. Then listen. Those battlefield emotions that the nanos press. Listen to them. What are you talking about? Shh. There he is! Kill him! <laughs> Can we take him? What's wrong? In a fight? The way he killed all the others? Oh God. Please God, don't let me die. Let's do this! I am the devil! This isn't fair! Little punk! Listen closely now. Die! This life! I watch my wife and son die. This is all I have left. You ain't shit! Goddamn, I even took my leg. <laughs> I needed a job. Stop! I didn't know what I was signing up for. Is something the matter, Raiden? <laughs> I barely saved enough to bring Baba to the stage. Finish him off! Whatever it takes to be free of this torture. Stop it! What am I even fighting for? Ah. Man, what am I fighting for? Yeah, 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 I'm conflicted, I'm conflicted. Oh, no. Blender time. Blender go Yahoo! Power thirst. This is dead. Get off. Yoink. Thanks for the Gatorade. Woo. Flop. I got an A. Woo. Look at me, Sam. Look at me go. Raiden, are you injured? <laughs> I thought they had a choice. A fair choice. Not like you. People are different. As opposed to AIs? You're all the same, huh? You and your brothers. Manipulating mankind for our own good. It appears my statement has upset you. I apologize. Uh, no, it's... I know you're right. As for AIs, we adapt as we learn. Just as any intellect operates, man or machine, altering the course of mankind is not among my divine directives. I guess that's a relief. Samuel's behavior does not match established parameters. You know him? Affirmative. Nice. We served okay. together on three previous missions. Samuel. He proved most capable. You think highly of him. I have always found him dependable. Until now. Scout him data for the next area. I'll patrol ahead. You follow. Let me just pac man. Always has been. He beams the maps in the Raiden's brain. Raiden, your current emotional state appears highly volatile. I am sure you do not intend to abort the mission, but I suggest you avoid combat for the time being. Slow walking section confirms it. Oh, you have not even begun to see the slow walking section. 
You aren't ready for the slow walking section. Although this might be the start of the slow walking section. You can't still stealth burn this. My eye will only do so if necessary. Man. Ooh, there is. Oh, that's. I thought it said item. It was a guy. A number of meters away. Music loud? No, it's loud. I can. Bring this smidge lower. He's wearing heels? Sure is. He's rocking them. The nails and the heels. You need to do stealth kills in this section, it's dumb. Yeah, uh oh. Better get in the cover. Ooh, a thing. Do, 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 do. Gimme. More guys. Sheesh. I am probably just walking a straight line there, right? Yeah, this is working out. I can't fight, I'm too conflicted. E. There's a guy like right there. Is there a way around him? Oh, he's leaving. No, don't. No, don't. No, don't. No, don't. Don't. Please don't. Okay, go. Oh, shit. No, this is fine. There's cutscenes if I make it over here, if I remember correctly. You can't cut the canister? Didn't need to. I made it. Hello. I'm just gonna scooch around the perimeter. I thought this was a cutscene area. Oh, shit. Okay. Yeah. My heart just ain't in it. Eh. Can't turn it back up, apparently. When the was over, they just threw me away. Yeah. Yeah. Like I didn't ask for this. I didn't ask to be sliced up by a mariachi. Hey, there he is. Yeah. Stop it. Nice dodge. I know. You know what? Shit. I can't attack That's anymore. Like right now, is it? Is your cause just? Or is that just what you tell yourself? Fuck you. How pleased you are to chop away, Jack the Ripper. My name is Monsoon of the Winds of Destruction. Yeah. I guessed as much. Looks here right in the cutscene. That's a thing you can do. Sides of your enemies? It's Pac-Man. How easily you ignore the loss of life when it suits your convenience. So tell me, who saves the weak from the man who saves the weak? You're the ones exploiting them. You take advantage of their weakness. Of course they get hurt when you set them up as your human shield. Kill or be killed, Jack. Phnom Pen taught me that. Yes, you aren't the only one to grow up on the killing fields. War is a cruel parent, but an effective teacher. Its final lesson is carved deep. Look right. At this world, this guy? And all its people are diseased. Free will is a myth. Religion is a joke. Controlled by something greater. Means. The DNA of the soul. They are the culture. They are everything we pass on. Expose someone to anger long enough, they will learn to hate. 
they become a carrier? Envy, greed, despair, all millions. How about full of shit? Is that a meme? You can't fight nature, Jack. Wind blows, rain falls, and the strong prey upon the weak. <laughs> Sam tells me you see your weapon as a tool. Something that saves lives, a means of justice. Now there's a pretty meme. Exquisite. It spared you the burden of all the lives you take. Absolved you of guilt. The cat destroyed. showed up the moment he said memes. It was like synchronized to when he said memes. That is until the illusion was broken. Yeah, all right. Thank you, Chad. Don't Holy be shit. ashamed. It's only nature running its course. You have no choices to make. Nothing to answer for. You can die with a clear conscience. Calbunga. You're right. About me, I mean. I knew something was off. After the Patriots, I thought I could walk off the battlefield and into a normal life. But here I am, surrounded by death, arguing philosophy with terrorists. I told myself this was about justice, about protecting the weak, but I was wrong. <laughs> then you admit it. I learned young that killing your enemies felt good, really good. In America, my friends, my family, they helped me forget the devil inside. But who am I kidding? I was born to kill! <sighs> the bit about my sword, that means of justice stuff, I guess I needed something to keep the Ripper in check when I was knee-deep in bodies. You? But you, all this is a wake-up call to what I really believe. What I really am. What are you saying? I'm saying Jack is back. Doctor, turn off my pain inhibitors. What? This, this is madness. You do it. All right. Pain. This is why I fight. <laughs> Lost your mind. Rules of nature. <laughs> the kitty guy got away. He's okay, Chet. Who's next? It was a different guy. A devil trigger. I'll take this dance. No, Sam. Report back to the chief. He's mine. <laughs> You're the boss. I misjudged you. You are like us after all. Now you're just being nasty. <laughs> that nickname you love so much. Wanna know how I got it? Actually, why don't I give you a demonstration? I think it's time for Jack to let her rip. Yeah! Let's go! Yeah. Forget it! Get the throat! I can take it! Pack your 
What does that mean? This one's on me. He has telekinesis. A thing fell out of it. Where's the thing? Ah! This is so stupid. Yeah, 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 yeah. More parts. More parts. Is it? <laughs> no. Hey, stop doing that. Stop. Stop doing that. Hey. Eh. What? Shit. Dad, stop it. Stop it. He's just kicking me. Am I? Am I? Oh. Do I? Do I have to EMP his body apart? Hey. Stop. Eh. Bonk! Fuck you! But not for me! Welcome to my utopia upstairs. That's not a utopia then, is it? Yeah. That does okay. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> Shit. Thanks. Did I get him? I got him. On, I'm trying. Ow, 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 ow. Too high. Where's his head? Where'd it go? Where'd it, where'd it? Damn it. Forget it. No, don't kiss. Does it hurt? Yes. That's apparently the point. Eat eat the paste. Eat the paint. There you go. Yeah. Uh, 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 what? Huh? What? Yeah. This is silly even for this game. Oh, shit. Parry it, can you? I have won this. Ow. <laughs> In. Fuck. That was my last one. 
Do I have something else I can use? Do these work? Can I hit him with the jam? Yeah, the feet! Not the feet! Uh, 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 foot, maybe the foot, uh, um, uh, the fucking feet rush <laughs> too much Is this a euphemism? I got a checkpoint. Now what? Check, Spiffer. You're dead. Bullseye. Fun fact, I've only ever seen the sequence with the sombrero. Kill or be killed. Don't be ashamed. It's only nature this running girl. its course. Your means end here. No, I passed one. Do you? Sure as the sun will rise. Wind blows, rain falls, the 
Rip remote tutorial now playable. Oh good. Well. Raiden? Hello. I'm fine, Kevin. Relax. I'll get the brains. I don't want this for anyone else. All right, man. Later. We'll be to Marshall HQ. You be. But he just what? But he just what? Chapter three, mile high. Baba's Baba is you and good. Tactical side dystopia. Baba Baba. Well, this is probably a good place to leave things for the day. I don't know if I can quit out, though. Give me that. Give me that. Give me that. We'll come back to this next time, though. About halfway. Perfect. Uh, slightly aggro powered by Lawrence Force, following Fleming's left hand rule for motors. This force is generated by a magnetic field created by the user's cyborg body. Electrical current flowing through the side developed after careful analysis of Monsoon's battle data. Battle plan? Strength up. Let me just equip it. How much for. 6,000? Done. The other one? No. Um, life up? Yes. Give me life! Fuel cell up, yes. Can't afford that. Unique what? What? Just that there's more. I know, I saw. Thanks. Good. That's good stun power. I want to try it out. Bump, 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 bump. Cannot afford any of these. None of Bupa. Does the sign not have any special abilities? All right. Well. Do we, do we keep the mariachi uniform on, chat? Does the hat stay on? I know you're all gonna say yes, so why even bother asking, but I figure I might as well ask. Okay. The mariachi stays on. Till the end of the end. <laughs> all right, fair enough. I don't know if I can actually quit out or if we'll maybe just watch the opening cutscene of this chapter. Unless we just walk in and go, neat. It's Black Mesa. Huh. You killed Monsoon. I'm impressed. The brains are in the server room undergoing training. Knock yourself out. Go nuts. You can take it off on Kojima stops being horny. So never. Got it. I got a son. Ooh, you throw that. Well, that's sad. I like having range. <laughs> Is that a receptionist? Yeah. I think it's I had her real quick. I'm sorry, sir. Our business hours for the day have ended. We are looking forward to your next visit. Ugh. Zan... That's... Agent. Is that correct? Yeah, that's correct. Watch out! Anyway. <laughs> Get out of here. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. This game is a good time. Uh, there's plenty left to go. That was just a normal lady. Yeah, she was actually a cyborg. That wasn't a complete AI. Um, I hope you're enjoying it so far if you've never seen this game before. It's a hoot. Uh, you want the survive connection? Lay it on me. Also, someone added me and had a meme when I was in the middle of a cut. So I didn't want to pause. If you got that again, he's one of my favorite games ever. It, I'm having a lot of time. A, a lot of time. I'm having a hell of a time. I'm having a, a, a lot of fun. Plus, when it came out, yeah, not immediately. It was within the first year of it coming out. Um, and I remember struggling way more because it took me way longer to figure out the parry. Um, I do have a lot of time. Gotcha. 
We will watch that later. Thank you. And what is it? What is it? also the... Okay, everyone's linking the same thing. Got it. Gotcha, gotcha. Thank you. Um, the parry. Yeah, I mean, knowing how to parry... I mean, it's not difficult. You attack towards an enemy, and then you assume a defensive stance. Um, so it's not really that bad to try and, and do. Um, but... Yeah, it's, the game does teach you in that tutorial, but again... A lot of people skip the tutorial. I probably didn't, but it's just like, okay, that's how it works, and then either promptly forgot or whatever. Um, but yeah, like, during that first dogfight, where you fight against Wolf before he's a good boy, um, yeah, if you're not parrying all the stuff, you just, like, don't get an opening, and he just stomps you. So you gotta parry him. Um, it does that you... Uh, yeah, well, they, they, they tell you, okay, well, they're gonna attack, and flashes right attack towards them. And it's like, attack towards them is kind of vague. It's more that when you, like, flick in that direction and hit the attack button, he does a different animation and then you can parry it. But, yeah, it's like, because I remember how that works. It's going a lot smoother than it went on my first playthrough, so I'm having a good time. Uh, anyway, let me get caught up on alerts. Thanks so much for hanging. Thanks for celebrating my partniversary. I didn't have a whole celebration plan or anything, but thought that this would be a fun thing to stream for the partniversary and such. Um, but then again, they want to parry and react so quickly. It's nice. Yeah, they do throw a lot at you. I mean, even, even during that boss battle, battle against the uh, monsoon, he's doing some very quick rapid fire attacks where you're having to parry them over and over. The timing's generous, so it's not that bad, but yeah. I really like the part where he's uh, coming at you from the smoke. You got a directional parry it. It's good. Hey, so I'm gonna Photoshop a small brown fedora and riding a la Parry the Platypus. The memes. Thank you, Trent. The memes. Uh, Maj, thanks for 20 months. Dr. Verbs, thanks for 27. I immediately love this game for deciding to reintroduce uh, accented voice acting to this setting and starting immediately the most ridiculous cartoon-esque mad scientist German accent you've ever heard. Perfect. No notes. Right? Oh, uh, Grant, thanks for 100 bits. Oh, sorry. 500 bits. I want to say because Barry's going to say pairing is vital a lot. I originally played this on mouse and keyboard. Found pairing almost impossible. I mastered dodging instead. You can absolutely beat this game without parrying. Yeah, but you're giving yourself a hell of a rough time. It's designed around the parry mechanic. Doctor is great. Doctor is a hoot. He's a good time. I also have video shits related. Well, shit. I will watch these later. Thank you. I just, I don't know if they're going to be safe to watch without getting a copyright claim or something, but thank you. Parrying the wheel is the equivalent of riding breaking monsoons Beyblade because of permission to let her rip. Yeah. This game's got a lot of, a lot of good stuff. Doctor Shibin 4. Well, this came out after 4. Um, ba -ba -da -ba -da -ba. Omega Platinum, thanks for a year. I needed my bar yee back. Ooh. Levi gifted a sub to Rules of Nature for their second month? When did that get gifted a sub before? Thanks. Meister Jazz, thanks for 15 months. A silly game for 15 silly months. <laughs> Smash Bros. 6 damn bits. This game's the embodiment of Crazy Awesome. Every single time in this game, you're fighting a boss and then the lyrics hit, I can't help but smile. Every fucking time. Even when I know it's coming, it still gets me. There's something about the butt rock going full butt rock that just, oh, gets me right in my bones. Especially in a first playthrough when I hadn't heard any of these songs before. Like, now I've heard them a million times. But it's great. It always is. Thank you, Mario Luigi. It rocks your butt up, especially if you have a subwoofer. Uh, Meister Jazz, thanks for 15 months. Uh, Odyssey's Odyssey, thanks for a year. Really isn't anything like this for better and for worse. Yeah. Zamui, thanks for 50 bits. This really is just Bayonetta Mask Edition. Nasty Crime Boy, Sleepy Jetstream, Call That Pajama Sam. Fertolino, thanks for 95 bits. After finishing the Arcadia VOD, I must retract a statement. Your Spanish makes me ill and my blood boils with anguish. Not even close to the worst, though. So good job. Thank you. Muchas gracias. <laughs> it is my job. To, uh, my, my, what I strive for... Whenever I'm speaking in, an all, uh, in a, in a non-native language, which is anything other than English, and English is already like a 50-50, um, any native speakers, I want them to be like, I have heard worse. That is like the, the apex of what I might be able to achieve, so thank you. Appreciate it, Fertilino. Bumpfist Cromwell, thanks for eight months. I love how guns became so ineffective in the Metal Gear universe and went back to swords. Well, also because, like, swords are, I mean, they made it so you can ninja run and deflect bullets, but they smartly decided, like, this game is, works better when you're fighting dudes one-on-one, -on -one, even when it's a group setting. So if they all surround you and open fire, be like, okay, now I'm just ninja running around. I don't know, I think there's a good variety of enemies. The spongier the enemies tend to be less interesting, I find, but, and they strike a good balance. It feels like, a, with some exceptions, namely when they when they lean more into stealth, or like the under underground section that was dark. Like, other than that, I think the game's paced pretty well, so it's good. 
I've heard worse, thank you. Moocher's grassy ass. Ugh. Ugh. That's ugh. Are you gonna finish it some other time? Yeah, well you should. Uh, let me, I don't remember if I have anything planned Thursday. I think we'll probably finish it Thursday. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. As for whether or not we do the DLC, that will be TBD, but uh, maybe. We love, we love Coke Shaky. Uh, Bumpus Combo, thank you. Fricolino, thank you. Uh, besides your language skills, I'm gonna put squil skills in quote there for you. I, Alice, uh, mispronounced skills and said squills. Uh, I also want to point out that there are more weapons in this game than the sword, and they're fun. Give them a whirl. Many don't. I know, I'm kind of tempted to go back to the sword, but I do want to try messing with each of the, uh, the new weapons as they drop. It's neat. They've got different play styles. Uh, Digby, sorry, thanks for 20 months. Nano Machines allow me to sub the very for 20 months, Raiden. The emotes, the ad-free experience, Raiden. This is the future. Kids in a thanks for soup. I wasn't here when you started. You might have mentioned it already, but there's extra DLC stories on Xbox that aren't on PC. I don't know what you're playing on. I am on PC. I'm on Steam. There's DLC that was exclusive to the Xbox that never got part of the PC. That's a bummer. I'll have to see what's available on PC then. Yeah, I'm playing the Steam version. I have access to the PS3 version right here. I thought the PC version might be a smoother experience, bugs notwithstanding, and it's been great so far. Um, the Steam message boards had a lot of people having issues. But yeah, I don't think the PS3 version had any DLC that I knew of, but that's new to me. Well, may, I'll, I'll do some research before next stream and figure out what's what. Um, ZZ, thanks for nine months. Enjoy your Ruby Key. Anki, thanks for soup. I've woken from a nap, and when did Metal Gear become an anime sword fighter? Since Raiden got here. Each hand, thanks for 42 months. Enjoy your Doki. Surely no dogs are gonna get Oh. He's fine. Wolf is fine. The other one I fought, less fine, but... I think they're just skins. The Japan version has an exclusive weapon, though. Ooh. That's annoying. PS3 has DLC, Sam DLC. PS3, PC has the DLC. Okay. Is it a separate purchase? Or is it free? I have no idea. Is it available after you beat the game? Um, I gotta have to find out unless you know. Uh, Coffee Corner, thanks again for the raid. He may roll a gift to the sub to Raiden. Invader Zimmer, thanks for 69 bits. Hey, chat. Firewatch is two bucks on Steam. It's cool. Pixel Gun Jennings for our bits. Can't wait to... F can't wait... F can't wait for the Kalactos fight. Bar bird. Yeah. Skyward Sword, my beloved. If Sky if anyone modded Raiden into Skyward Sword, we could Zandatsu the Bokoblins. I would like that game exponentially more. Because they'd be like, well, I'm blocking you this way, and you just slice through their skeleton arms, and you're like, see ya! Like, that'd be great. That'd be good. Gameplay DLC is in the PC version. Gotcha. I on the Steam version, I played both Blade Wolf and Sea. Gotcha. Thank you. Good to know. Do they become uh, accessible after you beat the game? Do you recall? Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. Amphi, thanks for 51 months. Doctor, inject Cyberpunk 2077 directly into my... And they said the letter C and then cut it off into my clavicle. Jacob Bacon, thanks for 96 bits. If Raiden is goofy with this emote, Bar Hyuk, would that make Pete Armstrong? Bar Sip. Maybe. Hmm. Hmm. Maybe. Hmm. Community. Raiden the community. Heat of the desert. Showing you what. Uh huh. Is that a reference? To Hold on. To what? Uh, Amphi, thanks for the hammy. Um, actually, that was a reference to unpacking because it has cardboard boxes. Ooh, gotcha. Toaster Posey, thanks for 39 months and a tier two. Do you need a hand? Soul Sasquatch, thanks for 30 months. Enjoy your house key. This game's soundtrack is so good. It is god tier. Amph Amphi, thanks for 69 bits. Boris, I just beat mommy. Sorry, I meant mommy. Sorry, I meant mommy. Sorry. Stop. Chemist, thanks for 69 months. Memes, couldn't have said it better. Polish Bear, thanks for soup. Hat party, hat party anniversary on this day. I'm a borf. Happy borf day, Polish. Hope you're having a good day. Glitch teeth and thanks for the raid. I'm not Jonathan. Thanks for you. Give this ball a hand. I'll see myself out. Camerson, thanks for 23 months. Chan again, thanks for three months. Cave, thanks for 69 bits. Uh, nice. Mega Man is different from what I remember. Skyfire, thanks for 21. So no head. Stop. Smash Man, thanks for 69 bits. Monsoon got memed to death. He got memed done. Track Rock, thanks for 100 bits. Uh, Smash Man gifted sub to Cotton Wings. Hey, welcome back. Enjoy your silver key. And Hot Flex, thanks for 71 months. Let me squeeze this in here real quick. Welcome. I'm packing skew. I'm packing. It's a great time. I did a play through that on stream. If you are so inclined, but I recommend playing it yourself first. It's a good, good game. Good little sweet little time. Let's go raid somebody. Let's go raid somebody. Let's go. I feel like I just raided Dan 
not long ago, but he's doing a Minecraft randomizer comfy times, and that sounds delightful. Shouts to the Mistral's theme. I, like, you can have a favorite out of the, the boss themes in this game, but the fact that they're all so distinct and so memorable, at least to me, like, man, it's great. Um, I don't know what our raid message is. Does Dan have Coke Shaky? Hold on. I have to do reconnaissance. No one tell Dan that I'm sneaking into a stream in a stealthy way that immediately gets a hostage killed. Uh, rules of nature. You could, you could just start spamming the lyrics to rules of nature. That could work. I think so. He does have Coke Shaky. So if you want a Coke Shaky and then find Google rules of nature lyrics, Dane's the reason Coke Shaky is here. He showed me Coke Shaky. That's right. I forgot. Thank you. Does he have speed lines though? I don't. I didn't check. I don't think so. But anyway, hope you enjoyed. Thanks for celebrating my partner anniversary. Can't believe it's been 86 years since I started streaming on Twitch. Thank you for being here. Uh, hope to see you next time for probably the lat latter half of this game. Might be able to finish it next time. This game's good. I, I it, this it still fucks. It's still really. I feel like it's aged really well, both like visually as well as mechanics wise. Other than some camera annoyances, but so be it. Anyway, thanks for watching. Go get out of here. Go say to Dan. Go have some comfy Minecraft rando times. See you later. Goodbye. Rules of nature. Do, 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 do. I don't remember any of the lyrics. Uh, goodbye. Thanks for watching, VOD Watchers. Hope you enjoyed Metal Gear Rising Revengeance Part Uno. Uh, thanks. Hope you're doing good. See you in the next part, maybe. It'll be great. There'll be more memes. If you've only seen this game through memes, you'd be like, I recognize this. <laughs> So, uh, it's wild to think that there's, like, probably a significant proportion of people who might be watching this that only know it through memes. It's a good game, and I hope you're enjoying it. Anyway, goodbye! Yeah. <laughs>